All righty, let's go ahead and uh, what's going on, Kareem? Yeah, first one in here. What's going on, Kareem? Okay, yeah, what's going on, Kareem? What's going on, everybody inside the chat? Let me uh, let me get myself a little bit set up right here. I gotta throw a. Uh, gotta throw that up there you know what i mean because uh you know we're kind of a big deal if you guys didn't know let's use this i guess like i know it's kind of bad but this kind of looks ugly but it is what it is we'll throw that right there oh dude i just yo i just looked over at the uh dude i just looked over at the screen and i see how many of you guys are in here already shout out to everybody that's inside of the stream guys we're gonna go ahead and build a ton of stuff i'm excited to show you guys what i have built um so far today i didn't play too much today but i have so much to show you guys um uh, you see that was from ops man he donates a ton of them inside the stream so hopefully uh you see him again today that way you can thank him not me but what's going on everybody inside the stream today we got a very nice stream first off a few hours early again you guys can see it on the screen screen right now hashtag epic partner everybody epic went ahead and they gave me or they gifted me a few items a bit early to show off to you guys on stream and then we're going to go ahead and take a look at some other stuff so this skin is dropping tonight at eight o'clock eastern standard time this is the brand new eclipse skin that is a battle royale skin but also is a lego skin which i think is actually really nice i like the colors on it i like how it pops again i don't get paid for this so i don't want you guys to think like this is an advertisement i just am kind of like excited that i get to do this what's going on everybody inside of the stream they also have this brand new back bling as well as this is what she looks like inside of the battle royale which again looks really cool really clean but the back the back bling is really funny looking you also get the brand new pickaxe that goes along with it, all sponsored by Nike Air Max. And then one of the coolest things is the emote, which is really cool. So straight out of a Nike box comes that Nike guy that was on your back playing into uh, the game, which is really funny. Uh, but I have this skin and I also got the Air Forian one, which just looks really funny. I like I kind of like him the best because he wears like his emotion straight on his face, like in 2D. So it looks a little bit funnier to me uh, than, it, than it does to you guys, maybe. But I really like his skin a lot. I also like the other one. Again, this will be inside the item shop today at 8 o'clock Eastern Standard Time in their Nike collab. So if you guys are going to get any of them, make sure that you guys go ahead and use the creator code crafty plays when you guys are doing it. But I'm excited to show you guys what I went ahead and started to work on and build today because I know a lot of you guys. We're in here last night while we built the garage and a lot of you guys probably got on today and saw hey we can't build in the garage and we can't put our cars in the garage so what is crafty going to do i'm sure a lot of you guys woke up today and were only thinking about me and what i was going to do and obviously not about yourselves at all right nobody was thinking you know hey what's going on what what's going on with crafty everybody was like hey what what am i going to do right but what does everybody think of the update today? Everybody spam the chat. WRL, WRL. I think that the update's a huge W, but I'm interested in seeing what you guys think as well. I think I'm gonna I think we're gonna see a lot of W's. A lot of W's in the chat. It was a great update, I think. It was a great update. You haven't played yet? Well, play through me right now. You know what I mean? Nothing but W's. I haven't seen a single L just yet. Can't wait for you guys to see what I started to work on, and then I'm going to show you guys why I did certain things uh, with my stuff. So, first off, I don't even want to show you behind me, but so what I did today was, number one, I gave myself the 
Uh, bad graphics. Uh, unfortunately, I don't play with anybody. This is all by myself. And this is like, th this is why I kind of get, this is why I kind of get the way that I am, guys. I add every single one of you guys that way that I can give you guys stuff, like gift you guys stuff. I I've done a giveaway, I think, every single day this week inside of the Discord. But the only thing that I don't like is being spammed with invites and stuff like that. So feel free to add me. Feel free to add me, guys. Um, oh, wrong one. Let me get this one up there for you guys. Okay, let me get this one up. Nope, wrong one. Okay, that one doesn't work. Okay. Can't get my gamer tag up there. Regardless, though, um, today, first thing I went ahead and did was I gave myself the Illuminator equipment. Okay? I gave myself the Illuminator equipment because I didn't really find myself looking at my compass all that much anyway. I don't know about you guys. I didn't really look at my compass anyway, and I do like that the light kind of lines everything up. All right, dude. Like, this is what I'm talking about, guys. Like, I... I this is the stuff that gets you banned or blocked. Like, I genuinely, I cannot stand when people act like this. Like, you're better than this, dude. Come on. And I just invited him to the party by accident. All right. If he joins, that's a problem. Regardless, though. Um. Yeah, we'll figure it out. Regardless, though. When it comes to this stuff, I went ahead and I did the Illuminator Charm because when it comes to this stuff... You don't really look at your compass anyway. I know that some people do, especially for caves and stuff like that. No, William, it's completely different than what you think, brother. I want everybody to add me as a friend. I don't have a problem with people adding me as a friend. The thing that I don't like is when people spam me with invites. You guys can add me as a friend because I do go ahead and give you guys stuff. If you guys are in the Discord, you check out the giveaway section. I've given away gift cards, skins, Lego set bundles, everything this entire week. I've just been going through the list, giving people different things. I love to gift you guys stuff. That's why I add you guys as a friend because it takes three days to gift, but don't add me as a friend and then start spamming me with invites when I'm streaming or recording videos because that ruins the stream. It ruins the videos, makes it more difficult for me. So unfortunately they don't have a do not disturb button, which is unfortunate, but regardless, people should know better. Nonetheless though, Illuminator charm because you're not looking at your compass all that much. And I also built myself five compost bins. Now, the reason why I did five compost bins, what's going on, James? What's going on, Jakey? What's going on, everybody inside of here? Um, I went ahead and created the five compost bins because they take extremely, extremely long to go ahead and actually build or, uh, you know, compost, I guess. Like it makes it, it takes very long to give you your biomass. So because of that, I made five of them. And I also have three of my villagers. I'm dropping a YouTube short on this tomorrow. I have three of my villagers working on the compost bins, two of the villagers working on glass. The reason why is because glass and the compost is what you need in order to make your power cells. So I should be getting power cells pretty much for free because of that, which is, you know, really, really nice. So three of them working on that. I also get the brand new links. He visited my stream or my, uh, my stream. He visited my, my biome today, which is extremely, extremely nice. I still got fish sticks and black heart as well. Outside of that, man, I didn't really do too much. I kind of organized myself a little bit, made sure that I was extremely organized with all of my stuff that did take a little bit of time, but what you guys are going to be able to see is the big stuff what you guys came here for number one i got my wrench just in case you needed it but i did find out that the wrench is honestly useless and we'll talk about why during the stream but you guys are probably wondering you have this garage i also got vehicles in this garage boy take a look at this whip son it's just a prefab it's nothing crazy um i also can't tell if the wheels are flat I know somebody messaged uh, and, and told me that if it has too much stuff on it, that the wheels uh, will be flat. So I think that the wheels are flat on this. It looks like it in comparison to the little one where like that one looks like it's floating. These ones look flat. Regardless, I'm not actually using these. I figured I would just kind of have these inside of here just to show like just to have. But. What I built was a storage unit on the back. I put an extra battery kit up top, which I'm never going to use. So I'll take that out of there. Power cells up on the front as well. 
And then I also have my smaller one, same exact thing. I have a power cell in there that I'm never going to use. So again, I have this. I'm never going to use them, but I do have them in there. Yo, Cypher with the five gifted memberships inside of the chat. Shout out my guy Cypher. If you guys don't have your settings turned on to receive gifts, make sure that you guys do. We have another visitor here today, which is Dana, of course. She does not leave me alone, but she's here. So it is what it is. Um, but so we have these two vehicles here, but that's not at all that we have something that absolutely will not fit inside of here is well, bam, We got the big boy. We got the big boy Once again shout out my guy He went ahead and he gifted five memberships inside the chat if you guys were just gifted a membership Make sure that you guys shout out my guy. Uh, he also gifted me an emote today, which is extremely nice um, I don't have it equipped yet, but he did give me the drum setter emote so he is extremely generous not just to myself but to you guys as well but i did build the truck today now i know what a lot of people are thinking with the truck it is extremely large it is also very slow but there's a few things that i did with this that i want to talk about today just to help you guys out as well as even just help myself out with this so first things first is this has four power cells inside of it from what i've heard is that's not enough right? Read in my comment section. It's not enough. So I put another thing of power cells on top, which has these four. And then I added these two chests on the back. Now the one chest is going to hold all of my food in it. That way I don't have to sit here and check for food. I also have biome specific. Um, I have biome specific, um, charms for when i go farming and then i have my second one here this has my sword but this is going to be like where i have kind of like a second backpack along with me um and i will throw my batteries in there as well just as like a just in case you know uh eclipse i'm sorry i'm not adding you back and i again i don't mean that to be disrespectful that's the second time that you've done that to me it's the second time that you've spammed me specifically on stream to try to get attention is what it is um so I also have the storage with all, all of these, and then I added thrusters onto the back of this as well. So when it comes to the thrusters and whatnot, I also have inside of this front area, I have a switch here, which I believe I was supposed to be able to switch and, and, and flip on and off, although it doesn't... Uh, actually allow me to maybe it's because i had my thing out regardless though i also have a switch on there as well to go ahead and flip for my three thrusters so this truck is going to be very very slow but it holds a decent amount of storage i have a ton of batteries and i have the three large thrusters on the back it's going to be difficult to turn but it is going to be a little bit easier to drive um which is extremely extremely nice as far as these like i said like I don't plan on really using them all that much anyway. I do want to go ahead and, um, oh, extend the truck. Yeah, I guess you could extend uh, the truck. That would look really cool. Um, the one thing that is really cool about this stuff, though, and what's going on, Spider? One thing that is very cool is, like, you guys got to realize there's so many little things that you guys can do with these cars. Like, j just like uh, Alude said, or Alude, you can, you can extend this simply by using dynamic foundations and extend this back to make it a little bit larger and then add more tires onto it to make it go even more. So there's a ton of little things that you guys could actually do with these trucks. I know that a lot of people are like, oh, it's not as customizable as we wanted it to be. It's pretty crazy customizable. What's going on, uh, Dodd or Dode? It's going Fizzer. And then you also have your flying vehicles, which are really nice. So with the flying vehicles, something that happened with the wrench was, again, you guys are able to actually go... Oh, I just started digging in my thing. You guys are able to change these into different channels. That way, you could use different thrusters for it as well. What's going on, Smith? Which is really nice. Although I did have somebody comment and tell me that all of that is pointless because you can simply just go ahead and use a steering wheel on your aircraft so apparently steering wheels on aircrafts work just as well which is really 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 sick how to get the illuminator yeah the illuminator is actually pretty chill um all you want to do is go into your workbench go to where your charms are at and then all the way at the bottom the illuminator glass wool thread purple thermal fish and the bright core in order to go ahead and get the purple thermal fish you just gotta fish late at night it's going pretty good though i'm really excited with this update I had a really good day especially on youtube today was a one out of ten day 
I also got these skins. Shout out to Epic. Uh, this is two hours early. I got it. I had it since like 10 a.m. But this is the big truck. So, Hedgy, this is the one truck that we have. You can extend this, uh, like uh, Card said earlier, make it a little bit bigger of a truck, make it a little bit more usable. And then you also have the Jeep, which you can use. And they showed in a trailer today that you could obviously add stuff on the sides as well to make yourself, you know, fly and put thrusters on it and whatnot. And then you also have like the little bit, you know, just a little thing here, little ATV sort of. So, so we'll see. Box I had everybody after the stream. But I will tell you guys something. I have not driven any of this stuff yet. Now, the only thing that I'm kind of questioning here is like when it comes to this activation switch here, how would I even be able to use this while I'm driving? I don't think I can, right? I would love to, but it doesn't seem like I can. Regardless, people said that this thing drives slow. I don't see it. This thing drives pretty fast. How are people telling... Yo, how are people saying that this drives slow? Are we for real? This is fast as heck. No, there's just no way that we're for real. This is fast. Seriously? Oh, there we go. Okay, I have the thrusters on the back. I, I can work it with my R button. Okay, cool. Yeah, are we for real? Dude, this is so quick. Oh, the front thing broke already. Okay. So the front part of this broke, that, that front little um, thing broke extremely fast, but this is so fast. All right, I'll catch you later, uh, Gamer Lab. I'll see, you, I'll see you later, hopefully. But yeah, man, this is actually so fast. I don't know how people were complaining that these weren't that good. Yeah, I saw that. I really like that, Nate. That was another thing that they really didn't mention inside of the update that came out that is really cool is the fact that you kind of magnet towards items now and pick them up really nice which is awesome yeah i hit a tree so it removed my thing so i have to kind of watch for that going forward only i don't know what i'm even driving to i did so much looting yesterday i really don't have much loot to get no news on the rift update i i try to tell everybody that we're months and months away from that happening okay here we go cool there's one small bug right there we're months and months and months away from the Rift update, which is not a big deal at all, and I hope that doesn't upset too many people. I just wouldn't... Don't even worry about the Rift update. That'll happen at some point in time. Yeah, the, the car and the buggy. Yeah, I definitely like them too. I think that this is crazy. I haven't driven the truck since, since it released yet, and I'm really happy with it. This thing goes fast as heck. I don't know why people said that this doesn't go fast. It doesn't go good up against hills, but... Overall, like this thing is, uh, this thing is quick. This thing is absolutely fast enough. I don't know why everybody, my comment section is it, like, I'm not even kidding. Like, I'm not just saying that my comment section all day today was like, oh, the vehicles are too slow. They're too slow. And it's like, I'm driving this thing in the, yo, I'm flying and I'm not even using the thrusters on the back. So I don't know how people think that some of these things are, uh, are too slow, but I really, I, yeah, I really like it a lot. I, I really do like it a lot. Um, the thing that came off the bat, the front, is the large front, which is wooden rods and wood. So I don't have that. I'll have to, you know, get that another time. Yeah, this is, uh, this is really cool. Nah, come on, Walter. That's just not true. I said, I, I was saying it last night. Every single person that's complaining about content and wanting more content and new biomes and whatnot, like, you, there, you can't even. You, you don't even, everybody that says that are people that barely play the game right now. And it's like, you couldn't survive a brand new biome. You wouldn't have enough stuff. You wouldn't have enough stuff for the brand new, for like the new content in the game. Like I had to grind all last night for hours. I did a four hour stream of doing nothing but farming just in order to go ahead and make sure that I was ready for this new update. There's no way that people are ready for, um, for a new biome it's just not possible i want it too i love new content but it's just not we're not ready for a brand new uh biome yet the servers aren't ready but also we just no you know you you have to pretty much be in like creative mode in order to get it there's just not enough uh i don't know i i haven't ever ran into the high complexity issue so i'm not too sure i'm not really the person that would um 
that could like talk too much about it. Yeah, Kyle, you think that, but when this snow biome or when this uh, shore biome came out, I was not ready for it. And I really thought that I was ready for this. Like I thought that like the shore biome it was going to be a piece of cake. I thought I was ready for it. But then I sat there and I started playing on it and I was like, hold on, wait a minute. I don't even have enough stuff for the shore biome. Especially as they continue to drop more content and stuff. I mean, we're just not even close. Okay, so another thing to look at here um, that is pretty cool. I see that, Glaze. That's pretty dope. Um, another thing that's pretty cool, if you guys look at the bottom of the screen, one of the um, one of the batteries that I have is obviously a little bit out of juice, but you could see that it shows eight batteries that are on here. So if you stack these power centers, then it's going to show up at the bottom. So I know that you guys think it, you only have to use the one where the pre-built area sells you, but use more than that. Use as many of you can. Like even on this Jeep, I have six of them inside of this area. So have as many of them as you can. Yeah. If you want to unlock the recipe for the illuminator charm, you do need the thermal fish in order to do it. Purple thermal fish. Okay, I need wood and wooden rod because I got to replace that little uh, that little thing. Okay, so what is there to do today on this update that everybody is uh, is thinking right now? Yeah, pink thermal fish. Uh, no, the engines, from what I read, don't make it go faster. The engines just make it go longer, from what I read. So I could be wrong about that, but that's what I read. Okay, I think that was right there. Yep, perfect. Cool. All right, and I'll keep the wood, and I will keep the wooden rods as well on my truck, which is cool. I'm a truck guy. You know, I'm a truck guy. Yeah, 181,000 people playing right now. That's lit. That's like a that's a 24-hour bonus, you know, debt for sure, or a 24-hour max for sure. So I have a YouTube short coming out about this tomorrow, and that'll be like a little bit, a little bit of like a, of a trick for you guys. But one of the things that's important to do with your villagers, guys, is make sure that they're working on the biomass stuff. So it's the new job in the game. So I have somebody like Salty. Again, my villagers just started these jobs, but I have Salty working on. Um, oh, okay. Can we can we get this skeleton out of here? I have the. Um, you know, I have Salty working on some stuff, you know, like the, the glass and whatnot. And then I also have other villagers working on... Did I not... Do I not have him on a job? Okay, I do. Dude. All right. I don't even want to talk to him late at night. But I have other ones on the biomass and the fertilizer and the soil. So the nice thing about that is they're all working on different things for me right now. Which ultimately means that I don't have to do anything when it comes to this update, right? Like, I don't have to go out and grab much inventory. I don't have to do much looting. I don't have to use much of my own stuff because they do all of the stuff for me. So if the new villager jobs don't show up for you, that's probably because you don't have enough compost builds down. I think that's what you would need. I could be wrong. But all of mine show up because I got a bunch of those compost down. And then like you guys can see, now I not only have 15 biomass, which isn't enough, but I also got glass out of that as well. So using this biome along with one of my other biomes is going to be really, really, really nice in order to um, farm all that without having to do much. And then, yeah, I got links today. I haven't looked for any of the other ones, but if somebody does come, then I'll replace one of my guys for sure. What's it on best killer? Make a boat? I'm not interested in a boat right now. I'll wait on that. I'll definitely get one at some point in time, but I'm not too interested in a boat. The other thing that's really nice, especially when, when it comes to this biome, as well as the Dry Valley biome, is they go ahead and they drop you bones and uh, blast core or blast powder to begin with. So you actually don't have to do much farming really at all while you're here, which is really nice. But I'm really happy with how this garage uh, came out today. With the black and white, which is really nice. What's going on, Carter? Shout out every single person that's inside the stream right now. We're going to go ahead and just continue to show off some of the stuff that we got in today's update. As well as, uh, you know, just continue to grind the game out. 
I think I got to make some more battery cells, though. I got two extra as well as some inside of my thing. I have a bunch of biomass. And then, um, like I was telling you guys with the villager trick, that's a really solid thing to do. And then also, just convert as much sand as you can into this, you know, into glass. And then turn it into your biomass. And then your, pow your what's it called? Your uh, battery power cells. Because right now in the game, your glass isn't required for really anything. And on top of that, you also don't need your biomass for anything. So you might as well just turn it all into cells and carry as much of that at, along as you guys possibly can. Why do I have so much iron? Just in case. I thought maybe we would need iron for this update. But it's also not a bad thing to just be full with everything that's out there. Uh, let's see. Yeah, the... Um, the, what's it called? The garage? You have to just break your garage door and then you can do it. So break your garage doors and then you guys are good. I had to pretty much rebuild my entire front area because I had to break this one door and that top wall and then go back down and then I was able to drive it in. What's going on, Icy? Alright, so now I got a decent amount of, of those inside of there, which is nice. I also got the biomass inside of there. Nah, come on, DJ. You already know the deal. You've been in here before, DJ. Can I click that? Yeah. All right, cool. Yeah, no tournament tonight, Evie. I've been trying my best to get that uh, approved. They just refuse to approve the uh, tournament map for whatever reason. I'd love to get it approved. I would love to play some custom games or, or some tournaments, but they just will not allow me to do anything. What's going on, Davidson? Oh, I know. Dude, it's so crazy. I'm sitting there. I'm looking at some of the complaints on my YouTube videos, and I'm like, are y'all playing the same game as me? Like, I'm sitting here driving some of these cars, and I'm getting feedback that they're too slow, and I'm sitting here like, hold on, yo. Like, what are we talking about it's a little too slow? You know? Oh, you think this is a lot of iron, by the way? Take a look at this one. Bang! Look at all this iron and bright corn and stuff like that. I'm caking right now in all this stuff. I'm caking into it. Nah, I'm not going to the sandbox. Sandbox is for weenies, yo. Sandbox is for weenies, dude. This is for... We're inside survival only, dog. Survival only. All right. So let's get as much use out of these trucks and these vehicles as we possibly can. So I'm going to carry four more of these batteries along with us as well. And... Uh, all right, Dodd. I'll catch you later. I was having balloon here when the car flips over. Oh, that's a good idea. That's a great idea, actually. All right, so I'm going to throw that in there. One of these batteries was dead, right? This one? I don't even know what you do with the battery. Just let it die. Can you throw it inside the compost? What's going on, Kristen? Could you imagine if you throw the battery inside the compost? Okay, so I'm really not going to use this. I'll just throw that down there. All right. So somebody said to carry a, and it's actually a really good idea, is to go ahead and carry. I hate that I have to do this every single time I load up brand new content. It's always messing up my stuff. Uh, to carry a balloon with you just in case your car flips. Now, I'm in the truck, so I don't think that this will flip. And one balloon definitely is not going to help when it comes to that. But have one pickaxe one axe one shovel i want i have to go to the snow biome and get some snow so let's make that like our mission today do more engine make a car faster no the only thing that you can do to make your car faster is just throw thrusters onto the back of it and use the brand new mechanic with the wrench so you have to use the wrench in order to go ahead and do anything to you know anything crazy with that all right let's get going now I'm going to carry the Illuminator Charm with me all day, all day today. That's going to be my main thing. Yeah, I haven't unlocked anything for the... Um, I haven't unlocked a single thing today for it. So should we drive the car or should we take one of the planes? What do you guys think? I, I, probably the truck, yeah. Yeah, maybe it's definitely possible, RM, because I really, like, I do not see how th how people are saying that these vehicles are slow. These vehicles are so fast, dude. Oh, let's go, Jackaroo. Yeah, I do like this skin here. The skin is funny. That thing broke off again. That is, like, the fastest 
what is the point in that? Make it so much, make it more durable. There's no reason that that's a thing. What do you mean mark the ground before I leave? Well, I know where I'm going. I pretty much know my entire map at this point. I just go north and then I go, and then I go back. Yeah, definitely hard to drive up hills, which is why I added the thrusters onto the back. Hopefully that helps me a ton. A cart in Lego Fortnite. Yeah, man, I can't wait to see what people come up with. I cannot wait to see what people come up with in this game. Uh, okay, Bay Graphics, that's not good. You might want to get that checked out. But, yeah, uh, these vehicles are definitely not slow. So, But enough of that, yeah. Go-karts and stuff like that inside of the game. I can't wait to see what people come out with um, over the next few days. YouTube is going to go crazy over these next few days when it comes to people releasing brand new content and stuff like that. I know for sure people are going to go wild with it. I can't wait to see what people come up with. Okay, so I might have to add more thrusters onto this because you just slide down some of these hills. I'm just sitting there sliding. I can't even turn. Yo! Let me turn my, my thing. I'm going to make it up this hill one way or the other. Hate making the power cells. Hey, man. The game can't be too easy. You know what I mean? For real. But look how I go up that hill. People are complaining about the hills. Come on. The hills are easy. Does the steering wheel work on balloons? I don't, I don't think it works directly on balloons, but it does work on the aircrafts. Okay, I think I'm stuck. Um, I think I'm stuck. All right, guys, I'm stuck. All right, first, definitely not day 16, I'll tell you that much. So for lying, that means we're, pu we're pushing it back to day 30. Man, dude. All right. My guy's saying press the S key, like as if I didn't try to back myself up. All right, let's go ahead and do this. Come on. Let's try to do this. Is that going to work? Um, <laughs> Dude, are we for real? Nobody's ever going to join me playing. I, I don't mean that to be, you know, rude or anything. It's just, you. I, I literally am not allowed to. If somebody plays in my world, then everybody has to play in my world. And if that becomes a thing, then it just becomes less fun because I have to kind of cater to everybody. So unfortunately, it's going to always have to just be me up in this thing. Yeah, a balloon would have helped. I, I didn't think a balloon would help in this case because I would have only had one balloon on this giant truck. And now I'm really going to sit here and be stuck. Like, there's just no way. I don't have a balloon. I left without the balloon because I thought there's no way that the balloon is going to help one truck. Like, are we for real? No, they don't. They don't reset, but there's a million. Um, there's a million caves in the game. So you're never going to run out. You just got to explore a little bit more. Dude, I cannot believe this. I can't believe this. All right, man. I guess I got to go and grab balloons. No, the truck is fine. You just have to carry a balloon. And I thought because it's a truck that a balloon is not going to help. But unfortunately, that's not the case. Speedster on the back? Yeah, that wouldn't have been a bad idea. Man, I cannot believe that, man. Yeah, I really like this skin. The purple Nike logo on it is pretty sick. Not even the biggest fan of Nike, you know what I mean? I'm more of like a check checks over stripes, right? That's what they say. I'm more like stripes over checks, but... You know how it be. Alright, we're gonna go back. We're gonna get We're gonna get a balloon just in case. And then that'll help me get out of spots. And then I should, in theory... Be good to go. Can I also say that the one thing I don't like about this update, and this is like super nitpicky, but I really don't like the flares above my head 
I don't have, I just don't have the materials for the thruster. I would have had to remove it and then build it again. I'd rather just get the balloon so I could just set that up every single time. Villagers, I think four. I did try to push it from the side. It just, it wasn't moving. It's no big deal. Everything that you guys are telling me to do, I tried. Uh, I'm not interested too much in a boat right now. One day I will build one though. Silk fabric and cords. All right, you guys got a nice look at my stash right there. You guys got a really nice look at my stash. What's going on, Rock? I can't. I can't even take it out of the garage. It doesn't fit outside the garage. I do not have Polar Peely. I haven't found any of the Polar guys, but we're going into a brand new Polar area, which will be nice. Yeah, I didn't place a floor under, but I was way too far before you, before you mentioned that. So we're going to try with the balloon method and see. I'm not breaking the garage, boy. You crazy. Break the garage. You crazy, boy. All right. This will work. Oh, definitely. And I'm going to be honest with you. A boat is not even worth it. There's like nothing in this game that's going to require you. Um, There's nothing in this game that's going to require you to uh, use a boat. Genuinely. Also, if you guys uh, have not played yet today, if you guys have not played yet today, the grapple glitch still works. So if you guys are wondering, hey, why are you still running with uh, 16 grapples or why are you so low? You're down to one grapple. The grapple gl uh, glitch is still in the game, which is really nice. And I'm surprised that it's still in the game because it genuinely shouldn't. Oh, that's really smart, Kristen. Yeah, that's probably a really, that's probably smart as heck to do. I should have done that. I also have to uh, guess where my vehicle is right now because I didn't mark the floor. This is more of like a video on like how not to play Lego Fortnite. That's going to be Dry Valley late at night. Or I think it's really any village late at night. You can find the purple thermal fish. Or the pink thermal fish. I'm sorry. Has to be the pink thermal fish. Has to be late at night in one of the uh, biomes. The cool thing is all I did was go straight and that brings me right back to my area. So let's hope, let's hope that this works. Let's see. So a balloon on it. Yo, a balloon, yo, the large balloon didn't even move this thing. There's no way, right? There's no way, right? There's no way that you could put a, a bunch of these on it and it's not how heavy is this thing how heavy is this thing okay all right cool we got it all right let's stop it stop it nope can we stop please can we stop nope oh the thruster is still on not stop yeah there we go all right now let's break them dang yep there we go oh okay hit the wrong thing yeah, i think it's like a million pounds Jeez. All right, there we go. Now everything is down and we are good to go. Now let's get rock and rolling. And let's just. Um, what is going on here? Okay, hold on. It is going in that direction. It's going in that direction. It's going in that direction. Going in that direction. Oh, there we go. All right. Sorry, my bad, yo. My bad. Hold on. I'm getting it together, yo. These new vehicles are a little bit tricky. New vehicles are a little bit tricky. Let me get down from here. Dude, there's no way this happened again. Are we for real? Get the vehicles out of the game. Get the vehicles out of the game. Are we serious? Come on, Epic. What is that? What is that? Come on, back me up. Back me up, back me up, back me up. Yeah. Here we go. Turn it. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go with the balloons on my back. How about that? How about I just drive with the balloons on my back? How about that? It has to be Dana. Yeah, what's up with this? What's up with the three balloons on it and going, huh? Now this is what I'm talking about. 
Nah, this truck cannot go near hills. But putting these three things on top, these three balloons, oh yeah. What I'm talking about now. Now we're rocking and rolling. Yeah, now look at me go. Look at me go. Now if I get stuck now, it's a problem. But for right now, we are cruising. We're almost going too fast. We're actually going... Okay, I'm, I'm going to destroy this whole vehicle. Um, I need to be going super far to the left. Okay, I can't turn left. I cannot turn left. Oh, I'm turning the wrong way. I'm turning the wrong way. Guys, I am turning the wrong way. Back up, back up, back up. Yep, back up. Keep backing up. Yep, and we want to go to the left this way now. Yep, go left. No, no, nope, you're turning right. Nope, yep, we want to go this way to the left. Yep, we're going to go to... Nope, do not turn that way again. We are going to go to the left. Yep, let's go left. No, dude, if Dana was right behind me, Dave Skirt, it would be a huge problem. All right, can I turn left in this game? Thrusters on. Can we turn left? I don't have tires on the front anymore. I don't have tires on the front. I don't have tires on the front. No tires on the front, man. No tires on the front. Now, how do you get tires on the front? How do I get these tires, huh? Where were they even on, on the truck? Up here? Oh, man, dude. That's awful. I'm not happy with that. I'm about to just destroy it and move on, dude. i am be honest. I'm about to just go back to the aircraft. I'm going right back to the aircraft. I can't do this. There's just no way. It just doesn't work properly, unfortunately. I mean, I'm sure that it does work properly. I'm also sitting there, like, sprinting around with, uh... I'm also sitting there, like, sprint... Dude, how much stuff did I have? Yeah, this is gonna be a problem. Shout out to Haley with the five gifted... Now I gotta do five, like what, 10 dab stands on top of the screen? Thank you so much for that. So that didn't go as planned. Um, we gotta figure out what we can drop here in order to make more room for ourselves. Uh, probably the blast core, the powder, or the pumpkin. And uh, yeah, this is gonna be a big problem. Oh man, dude, I cannot believe that. I cannot believe this, man. Oh, dude. Huh. <sighs> yeah, that's where I'm gonna go. I'm I'm gonna go to the I'm trying to go to the Frostlands, but I unfortunately can't drive there. Because this game hates me. So I gotta go all the way back. I gotta go back and forth now because this thing broke. So that wasn't very cool. That was not very cool at all. Oh, man, that was not cool at all, dude. Not cool at all. I'm very upset with how that happened. I'm very upset with that. Yeah, they're just not... Yeah, the front of it... Like, you, you should almost, in a way, be invincible. You should almost, in a way... And I know that might not make sense to many people, but you should almost, in a way, be invincible. Thank you again to Haley for the five gifted memberships. Um... No, I mean, the, the update overall still is good, and it's nice to have these vehicles. They just can't be used probably the way that we want to use them. Ah, like, the way that I want to use them is I want to be able to... I probably kind of like how everybody else does. Like, I, I want to go into other biomes and, like, 
I, I want to go into other biomes with my stuff, you know. But unfortunately, you 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 kind of can't in a way. So, you know, that's unfortunate. But, you know, ultimately, what are you going to do? You know, ultimately, what are you going to do? Is what it is. Um, I'll bring the shells, the shells back. I'll keep stuff. I guess, I guess I'll, I'll keep stuff here that I can genuinely keep. Oh man, that's so disappointing though, dude. No, it's just a game, man. I cannot believe that. I can't believe they just did me like that. Oh man, I was having such a good time in, 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 uh, in the car too, because you were just rocking and rolling. I was having so much fun in that thing. And then it just had to break. It had to break on me. Man, dude. Yeah, definitely have to make, like, highways for sure. Oh, my God. Are we for real, dude? Can we get out of my way? Thank you. Get out of my way. Get No, just get out of my way, please. Thank you. I don't want to deal with you guys just yet, okay? What am I going to put in storage, man? These... Ah, dude, I'm so upset. I'm so upset. I'm just gonna use the aircraft. I'm just gonna still use the aircraft. Because this just unfortunately does not work the way that I would like it to be. You know? I don't know if I'm a bad driver. I'm not saying I'm a bad driver. Come on, Keaton, dude. Come on, man. Come on, brother. You're better than this. Um, yeah, man, I, the, like I said, they're just not durable enough. And for as big as they are, they gotta be more durable than that. They gotta be more durable than that. There's no reason that they're, that they're that, that, that they're not that durable. It's a giant truck and you can barely drive the thing it is what it is at the end of the day. Hey, it is what it is. Uh, more, oh my, she's gonna eat. Look, they're going to eat all my, they're going to eat all my food. Get away, dude. Get away. Stupid chicken. Heavy wool. I don't know. It's used for a few different things. What can I bring back that I know I'm not going to use? This, right? Food. I got to conserve the food a little bit, right? Ah, oh, man, dude. I'm so disappointed. I'm so mad. So mad and disappointed right now. Um. Okay. What can I bring back? Anything? Wood I can hold, right? Charms, I guess. Glass powder. Eggs I don't need. Let's get rid of these. I don't even know if attaching something would have, you know, really done anything. There was something on the front of it. It still didn't. It just didn't work. Even with something on top of it, it didn't. It unfortunately didn't stop it from, you know, tipping over and not working. So I, I don't know what could be done differently with it in order to make it. Uh... Dude, are we... For real right now, dude. Are we for, are we so serious right now? Yeah, man. What an what an awful day of car driving. Um ah, sorry, let me catch up the chat now that I'm no that I'm no longer being negative about my truck braking that I worked so hard on. Yeah, I was going to until Fatso walked up on me. Curse bones. Uh, curse bones are for the regeneration charms, which are extremely, extremely, extremely useful. You definitely need them. Uh, I don't know. I think they just wanted people to be on the game. I think they probably made the power cells last a little bit longer because they wanted people to like get on the game and play. But I could be wrong. What's going on, Bamboo? Shout out every single person that's in the chat watching me. Absolutely. Like, Literal, like, literal mechanical mayhem is the perfect name for this game. Because literally is mayhem. That truck did not last five minutes. Genuinely, I wonder if the truck actually lasted five minutes. Five minutes concurrent without some sort of issue. Yeah, I don't, I, I, I don't understand what Fire Monkey meant when he posted that. Because he was the only pers person that posted something about an Osiris cave. And it didn't have anything to do with it, so. Definitely is mayhem. It's an unfortunate mayhem, but it's mayhem. It would have been a lot cooler if it lasted longer. 
Yeah, it, well, yeah, because I would have had to use the boat over grass, Hedgy. Good point. Yeah, I, I will be honest. I don't know, like, and I don't mean to, like, talk bad about Epic. I love Epic. I love what they do. I love the game. I love everything about the game. Except the fact that it does, I don't feel like they had people genuinely test these vehicles. Uh, it works, but it works on certain things, Eli. This skin you're asking about? You're asking about this skin? The skin that I'm running is actually gifted to me by Epic Games. They gave me two skins. They gave me this one, and then they also gave me the Eclipse skin, which are brand new skins dropping into the game in an hour and a half at 8 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. Yeah, Stranger, I think we're going to get a lot of stuff just like that as well. So I'm not too worried about it. I think we're going to get a bunch of stuff. What? Did y'all just see what I just saw in there? We'll pretend like we didn't see whatever that just was. Whatever that just was, we'll pretend like we didn't see it. Where, where were you at? Were you in the toilet? They were just sitting inside the garage like that? Like, okay. Alright, the good news is we still have a ton of batteries. Uh, yeah, so we have a ton of batteries, which are absolutely pointless because we're not going to use them because the car is kind of stink. Awesome. And I know people are going to get very upset when I do what I'm about to do with the vehicles. And I sit here and I start to still use thrusters and whatnot, even though people tell me that thrusters are pointless at this point. But we will do. Five uh, purple therm pink thermal fish. Sorry, I keep calling it purple for some reason. I don't know why I keep calling it purple, but I do. It is what it is. It could have been purple. Throw this in here. Bang. All right. Now let's go back with a actual vehicle and we will go. Yeah, I got to be honest. I just don't even, I just don't even care about the power cells anymore. I'm done with them. Where's my pickaxe, dude? I left my pickaxe. Oh, they are purple. I could have sworn they were pink. I don't know what I'm saying, dude. The Atlantis biome? Dude, I don't know. They really should. They're going to do something underwater. They're going to do something underwater at some point in time. It's just a matter of when. There's so many things that they can come up with. What's going on, Elon? What's going on, trees? So many different things that they could do in this game. So hopefully, hopefully it gets crazy. I appreciate that. Um, why would why? But why would I restart my? There's no reason for me to restart the game. Yeah, I'm having a ton of fun with the update too. I just liked getting on today and having a lot of stuff to go ahead and do, which is really nice. So this is the new update when it comes to the thrusters and things like that in the game. People did say that you could actually just place down your steering wheel inside of here and you didn't actually have to worry about it but i didn't bring planks with me so whatever fight me uh, i do have every car none of them are my favorite none of them are my favorite because it broke already i had a truck and it broke immediately so none of them are my favorite just yet i'm not I, I i i've said it a few times i accept everybody's friend request at the end of the stream and i apologize if i sound frustrated when i'm talking about that stuff I really do. I apologize. I'm sorry. Shouldn't have said it like that. I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, apparently, Jay, people are commenting that you can just use a steering wheel on it. And uh, and that would be fine. But apparently, you don't need the thrusters on it. Although the thrusters do, do seem a little bit cooler. Oh, that's actually smart. Yeah. Motor and thrusters. Yeah, that's... Because I'm sure that you could make this look extremely, extremely, extremely nice with it as well. So, we'll see. I mean, I'm happy. This is probably my favorite part about the update is this specifically. Yeah, that, yeah, that, yep, uh-huh, this, yep, uh-huh, yep, this specifically, yep, uh-huh, yep, this specifically, yep. There we go, cool. All right, when you're up here, cool. Um. Oh, yeah, I'll definitely have to check that, uh, check that out. But yeah, um, 
I'm hoping that they fix the vehicles. I think that the cars and the trucks and stuff like that definitely have to be a little bit um, more durable. Like maybe not break at all. Maybe literally make them so they don't break. That would probably be the best thing. But, you know, we'll see. I also don't know where I uh, originally died at. So, okay, yeah. I don't know where my uh, truck broke at, but it's somewhere over here, right? Somewhere? Where did my truck break at? The, the cars are not slow. Let me tell you that. The cars are not slow. They're very fast. They're almost too fast. Add thrusters onto those bad boys. I promise they're not slow. The things glowing above my head is the brand new Illuminator charm. There's a white chest right there. Is that mine already? I don't know where I died at. Yeah, the brand new Illuminator charm. Which is really cool because it allows you to glow even without the need of a of, of a bunch of different stuff. So speedster yeah the speedster could be cool i was really looking forward to the truck the truck to me seemed like the coolest thing to have but unfortunately it broke extremely extremely quick so I'm not too happy about that i have no idea where i uh died at because i didn't ping the floor which is awesome yeah i saw that i i don't even need the thrusters on this but i have them so it is what it is we're doing it old school style um, and I don't have any idea where I died. So it is what it is. I guess I just lost all that stuff. Cool beans. Oh, wait, no, I should know. Cause I have my, okay. It's all the way back there. What am I doing? Yeah, I'm tripping. There we go. Uh, we're going to go right a little bit. Yep. This way. And then straight. Cool. I got it. Oh, it has been a long day. Is there any way to steer planes? I believe that you could do the same exact thing that I'm doing now, but I believe that you could do it with a steering wheel, from what I was told. Sorry if it took me, like, a little bit uh, to spit that out of my mouth. I was just sitting there word fumbling. But I believe that you could just use a steering wheel on here rather than using the Interact on three different things. Oh, closing in on 200. Make sure you guys like the stream so we get 200 so, um viewers we've never hit 200 viewers yet on this channel we've been so close we hit 198 one time and that actually made me a little bit upset because i just wanted to hit 200 and we missed it by just a tiny little bit so make sure every single one of you guys likes the stream that way oh hold on wrong one yeah there we go there's that one like the stream that way we can hit 200 live viewers it'll be the first time ever that i did it but the lights on top of me they are and now I have the uh, running glitch. Awesome. Yes. Dude. I don't need that. What, am I, what do I need? Okay. I don't need this. Let's grab as much of this as we can. And we got to return it. And then we're going to come back. Cool headed charm. Do I? Is there anything really even in here that I need? Oh, Shmoo with the five gifted. I appreciate that. So, 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 so much. I'll replace the bones. I'll replace the feather. I'll replace the bread with the pie. I'll replace the one blast core with this. I'll replace the inner charm with that. And the rest of this can go. It is what it is. Hasta la vista. I will catch you later. I'll take this purple one and I'll replace it with the vine. I could always get myself more vine and I should be good to go now. But yeah, it's cool that now I have my glitch with my stamina. Awesome. I love the glitch with my stamina. Let's go back to the home village, and then we're going to put some stuff away, and then we're going to go into snow biome. We're going to get myself some snow, and then we should be good. We hit 200. Shout Let's go, baby. Shout out to the 200 people inside the stream. 200. That's what I'm talking about. Make sure you guys leave a like inside the stream. If you guys are not subscribers to the channel, make sure you guys become subscribers of the channel. Thank you guys all so much. We've never hit 200 people live in stream we did today. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Thank you guys so, so much um how's the update update is good i'm not gonna say great i'm not gonna say great i'm gonna say the update is good the reason the, re the reason is and i'm sure other people will agree also shout out to shmoo like i said a uh, gb nicholas fritzko newport dire origin and psycho you guys just became brand new members inside of the youtube so make sure that you guys go ahead and thank shmoo inside of the chat for getting you guys five memberships 
that'll help you guys out especially inside of the discord but i would say that the update is good not great the reason is as we found out live on stream the vehicles aren't the greatest the vehicles are not the greatest but they're pretty good the airships are much better the airships are much 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 better and um there's not as much lag. There's not as much falling off. I mean, you still can fall off them, but it's just not as much. And then also, you have uh, the regular vehicles are just not all that great in comparison. Uh, I had the truck. It gets stuck on every single hill, and it also breaks the front end of it if you hit rocks and little things, which kind of stinks. And then also... Um, you know, yeah, just the durability is not that great. It all broke pretty, pretty, pretty quick. So I would say the aircrafts getting bumped or, or getting like boosted or, or a little bit better is probably the best part of this update by far. So definitely the best part of this update. And it really isn't close. The rest of the stuff is like, okay, but this stuff is probably the best part. Uh, I will make a video on the best aircrafts and stuff like that. I'm going to build more than what I have right now. But... Um, Mainly, I want to get away from this, this little stamina bug that I have. Again, this skin comes out into the item shop at 8 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. This is the brand new Nike collab skin. Epic was nice enough to give this to me uh, a few hours early. I mean, pretty much a full day early uh, to go ahead and show it off to you guys so that uh, you guys can see what is dropping in the game today. This is one of those items. So... Very exciting stuff for myself to partner up with Epic and be able to show you guys some of this stuff. So, if you guys uh, have V-Bucks and want a new skin, this one is pretty cool. I like it because his head is very funny. It kind of looks like a thumb. And there's also another skin that we'll put on after we reset ourselves because we got to back out of the game because we still got the stamina glitch, which should not be in the game anymore, Epic. The stamina glitch should not be in the game, Epic. Let's get that fixed. Yeah, I saw other people saying that as well. Uh, the rumor that I saw as far as them lowering the prices on the Lego kits is they may do that if they get bad reviews. They did put out a survey asking people what they thought about the prices or if they wanted to buy some of the items. And it looks like people are obviously going to respond to that and say that they don't feel like paying a million dollars for some of this stuff. So... Hopefully that means they go ahead and they lower the price for everybody, which means that more people are going to be able to buy some of the items that are inside of the item shops. Favorite car in the update? None of them. I don't like any of the cars, and that is just me being honest. Uh, the cars don't seem to work all that well. Because they don't work very well, I do not like them. So hopefully they fix that, though. Hopefully they fix that. We will find out if they do fix that. Uh, I don't know why you got uh, 900 V-Bucks. There was something that I, I read earlier about people getting uh, V-Bucks for like random stuff in the game. So I'm not 100% sure why, but hey, you know, how do we complain, you know? General World does work on aircraft. Yeah, I, I heard that as well, which is cool. I think that you could just assign it to uh, some of the stuff. So I'm going to put one on my aircraft and see exactly how it works. And uh, we will test that out just now. So... Let me go ahead and back out and put on this new skin and try to get rid of that. Um... I saw that Eevee, but I'm also a Fortnite crew pack member and I didn't get 950 V-Bucks from them. So I don't know if I can believe that. And we also got this gift from Sony, which is the El Dorado, the gold Durburger. Thank you so much for the gift thank you so 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 much tear um so this is the new skin it kind of looks like a blob but it's like a funny looking blob i really do like it a lot i really do like the skin it's not gonna be my new skin you guys know i can't turn my back on my main man but the other skin that they gave me was the eclipse skin this one looks a little bit cooler because this one is much brighter and a little bit more fun but yeah i unfortunately did not get 900 v bucks i already had this let's go back in and play with my stuff so yeah hopefully with that new survey they they talked about they're gonna go ahead and actually um do us all a favor and you know remove that stuff from the game so 
If you guys want to add me as a friend, you guys can add me right there. Again, I accept all friend requests at the end of the stream. Just keep in mind, if you guys are added onto my friends list, just do not spam me with invites, join requests, or anything like that. Yeah, I think the, the, the thing is, um, no, Eclipse, again, please, please, rather, please, please, please. Um, the, the, when it comes to the, the builds are, or the cars, the prefabs and stuff like that, I do really like them. I really do. I love the prefabs. I love the builds. They look nice. They drive nice. I know people were complaining about the drive. They do drive nice. I appreciate that, Big Jones Plays. Um... So they do drive nice. They have a lot of really nice things about the vehicles. The only thing that kind of stinks about them is the durability. And I know it's asking a lot out of Epic, but I do hope that they change the front of it. Dude, I just spawned in. Are we for real? I just spawned in. And she's right here again. I did, Evie, yeah. So I should have gotten it, but hey, it's no big deal. So this is the other skin. This is called Eclipse. Again, shout out to Epic for giving this to me early. Hashtag Epic Partner. But if you guys want these, they release at 8 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. Can you please just get away from me? Yeah? All right. Can we, Shmoo, can we handle that, you know, in, in, the, in the chat, you know? I think you kind of know what's being a little bit bothersome. But for seating, let's go ahead and let's make ourselves the steering wheel here on to our car so i think we just need a small steering wheel plank granite and cord plank granite and cord the background of lobby looks new yeah the background of the lobby is new this is also uh dana or this is also link sorry dude dana is unreal dude she's in my head she's literally in my head right now plank and granite but yeah, all we need is durability on uh, on this stuff, and we will be good. I also really do like the brand new addition of the lights here. So if you guys don't know, this is the brand new, and I've talked about this a few times on stream tonight, but the Illuminator, which is equipment, it does take over your compass, but let's be honest, most of us barely look at our compass all that much. Anyway, this gives you light even when it's dark, which is very, very, very nice. So I like it a lot. Yeah, there are building parts for cars, so you could build custom cars as well, which is pretty cool. But now we got to go back. Yeah, the Illuminator is really useful. I like it a lot. So the only reason why I honestly might not use the steering wheel in this case is because I have to put these things down in order to land myself. I think it honestly might make more sense to use the steering wheel on your aircraft when it comes to uh, much larger vehicles. Uh, I don't think so, Nick. It doesn't look like uh, it doesn't look that like it. It would be really cool if it did come with um, with a different type, but it doesn't. I haven't seen anything yet, and I've added pretty much everything onto my. Uh, I've added absolutely everything on to my thing. But maybe maybe somebody knows. Does anybody know? Maybe if you add like an epic or a legendary. Yeah, you can break the balloons too. I didn't even think about that. I think it just shoots down really fast and it also kind of goes a little uneven where if you just put that like square directly over the center, it'll do it completely on its own, which is really nice. Um, But yeah, I hope that they increase the durability. I hope that they do add another illuminator charm, like maybe an uncommon or a, I guess a rare one or a legendary one. Maybe can somebody check? Maybe if you add legendary or epic uh thermal fish maybe that'll help oh that's actually a good idea too tear um i don't know i first i wasn't I, i'm not really too great at building in this game i'm gonna be honest with you well, there is a there is an uncommon illuminator, right? Because I got one. I got the uncommon illuminator, technically. But yeah, I didn't know if maybe you could put thermal ones in there and that work as well. I don't know though. But I wish I, I kind of wish that we got another one that maybe you used like legendary ones and that unlocked or something like that. Because this light is really nice, but like, hey, what would it would it hurt us to make it a little bit brighter? Because I have to go test it inside of a cave. We're gonna go into a snow biome cave. 
and we're going to take a look at it and see how things go. I also have to get some snow. I have a ton of room in my inventory here for snow now, uh, just to go ahead and get that checked out as well. Yeah, I just don't think it's worth... Uh, I wouldn't use any cursed bones inside that thing. I think a, a lot of people... And, and I noticed this today, like especially while we were all testing it. Testing this stuff is really cool to see what happens inside of these areas and whatnot. However, if we're just being honest with ourselves, the best thing to do is hang out in the dry valley or the, the shore biome and just collect as many skeletons as you possibly can. That way you get a ton, a ton, ton of stuff out of it no reason to waste cursed bones or brute scales or claws or anything like that i was already doing that i wasted a ton of stuff just testing it and i absolutely should not have but i learned my lesson as we all do i'd also like to say guys yesterday we gained 330 subscribers on youtube probably my biggest day ever on youtube so if you guys are new to the channel shout out to you guys for coming back um to the channel so i appreciate every single one of you guys for coming back but my day has been going pretty good no my day actually was not stressful believe it or not update days are the easiest days for me i appreciate that so much big jones i have to you know continue to get better uh with my content and creating videos but we will do that as time goes on but update days are a lot easier than non-update days because for me, an update day is like, hey, let me go cover everything that released in the game. So it's a little bit easier. On a non-update day, I have to really use my brain and think about what I'm going to actually create. So it's a little bit more difficult for me on non-update days to create content. So today was a very non-stressful day. I honestly, I watched an entire movie today, actually, which is like the first time that I've sat down by myself and just kind of relaxed you know, in, in a decent amount of time. So that was nice. Oh, let's go, Chris. That's what I'm talking about. But yeah, shout out to every single person inside of the chat. Shout out to every single person that was hanging out because, uh, like I said, we've been on a roll lately. We've been growing and growing and growing and growing and growing. And I could not be happier about that. Obviously, I am officially a full-time content creator, which is absolutely awesome. I watched Roadhouse um i i didn't know like really what to think about it when it was coming out like i didn't think it was going to be a good movie i wouldn't say it was a bad movie it wasn't a great movie but it was it was a pretty good movie i like pretty much every single actor in it i just think that overall like the movie wasn't bad the problem with the movie was that like the supporting cast actors were just eh so yeah connor actually was like connor wasn't bad for a first like for his first time acting I, i'll be honest he really wasn't bad and that's not me meat riding him i do love him as a fighter but uh he he wasn't bad like could he have been better yeah but it was also his first time acting so how can you really hate him let's go corbin but yeah and and i've never seen the old one so i imagine that the old one is probably a lot better Cruz. <laughs> I imagine that the first one was a lot better than this one. Uh, the other thing that I have to look for while I'm out in this snow biome, guys, is the Peely and the Frozen Fistics because I did not explore this snow biome. So a lot of people, a lot of people, and maybe some of you guys in the stream uh, like to uh, think or believe that. Um, the biomes, like they don't reset and there's not enough loot. And what are you going to do if you run out? And yada, yada, yada. But the truth is behind a lot of this stuff um, is you actually have multiple of the same biome. So just because you don't see a second shore biome right away doesn't mean that it's not there. There's multiple shore biomes in the game and there's multiple dry valley biomes in the game. So you actually can um can explore multiple biomes if you don't find certain things in the game so if you guys think oh i already searched this shore biome or i already searched this snow biome or i already searched you know so and so you know hey there's multiple that you guys can go and check out so make sure that you guys uh start to do that if you guys have not done that i also am landing right here next to two wolves while i don't have a sword which was a brilliant idea by me. A brilliant crafty. Thank you. Somebody asked what I did before. 
uh, YouTube. Um, you know, really not much. Car salesman, DoorDash, Uber. Uh, worked at an Amazon warehouse. Worked at a FedEx warehouse. Did a lot of different stuff. What activities do I recommend to people? I mean, th this is kind of a good question. What do I recommend to people to do when they get bored of playing Lego Fortnite? Keep going. Just keep playing. Uh, no, but for real, um, it's difficult because... Dude, can you stop running from me, please? This does less damage. It's crazy. Taco Tuesday for your kids? Hell yeah. Yeah, just explore, honestly. You just got to keep exploring. Um... There's so much to do on Lego Fortnite that people don't even, you know, understand yet. Especially now with uh, the, you know, you have the brand new shore biome. Not really brand new, but you have the shore biome, which is awesome. Uh, especially to build in. You have the new Lego sets to build in if you have the money to buy them. Obviously, don't sweat it if you don't have the money to buy them. But there's so many different things that you guys are able to do, um, you know, in this game. Exploring, getting every rare villager, making sure that you're stacked up and ready to go when there's big update days like this. So there's a bunch of things that you guys are able to do on the game. Some of it is boring, of course. You know, like sitting here and farming and, and, and riding around and yada, yada, yada. It is very boring. But at the same exact time, it is something to do at the end of the day. There's so much to explore, yeah. So many little seeker items. So what I would do, like, if you're somebody that was playing the game, something that I would do, and again, maybe it's boring for you, but I would go onto Google and I would look up some of the secret items in the game and then go out and see if you could find them. Like, if you're bored of the game, you don't know what to do, go ahead and try to do that. But yeah, Cyber, I wanted to stream a little bit earlier today, um, you know, just because the new update and everything like that. I wanted to see what everybody's thoughts were on the update. And everything like that yeah new biome i think everybody wants a new biome but i don't i i don't think that the game is ready for a new biome i don't think that we are ready for a new biome i think there's so many more things that we need in this game before we get a brand new biome server maintenance obviously now vehicles to actually work correctly i think another backpack we need i think there's a lot of really small items that we need added into the game that we may or may not be thinking about, which which kind of raises a good question, right? Hey, every single person that's uh, you know, that's watching, if you guys have your chat bar open, type in chat one thing that you guys think that we need in the game that isn't, you know, super bland. Like, don't comment, don't, you know, don't comment that we need um, a new biome or new creatures or something. Comment something like really specific, something that you think that we need. Like, example, something that I think that we need is an extra backpack. So what do you guys think that we absolutely need inside of here? Paul, if you were typing in poop, we already have that. All right. Raids, that would be cool. Like, yeah, like little mob hunting and, and stuff like that. Or like, you know, raids coming into your village. That would be really cool. A repair bench. I do see a lot of people say that. I'm not opposed to a repair bench, although I don't think that it's like the most needed thing. Cheese maker is good. Railroad tracks. You guys are, yo, you guys are typing so fast. I'm doing my absolute best. Rift to go. Rift is going to go a little bit different. Rift to go is going to come into the game, but it's not going to go the way that you guys think. Custom gliders. Definitely a grapple repair station. Not needed. We got the glitch. Stability fixes. Christian and I are on the same page for sure. Dana getting nuked. An absolute W. Advanced weapons, I agree with you. Legendary items, as in what, Shang? What are you talking about for that? Crafting bench, Hedgy, that's a good one. Maybe we get that. Zip lines for sure. Zip lines for sure. I think that the problem now with zip lines, now that like we have all of this stuff, is like, how are they going to make stuff fast enough for it? Teleported to your friend's world would be really cool as well. Custom gliders, I saw that. That's a good one. Tacos, I believe that that kind of got hinted at in the game. As well as the fact that we are going to get the taco uh, map or uh, Lego set soon as well. Ladders would be cool. We kind of have seen them just a little bit. Fast traveling. I don't. I don't know how I how I feel about that. I don't. I don't know how I feel about certain fast travels. Yeah, zip lines would be really good for mountain to mountain. The thing that I don't like, or the thing that I'm scared about when it comes to the zip line is it's it might not be fast enough compared to some of the normal stuff that we could do in the game but it might make it a little bit more fun it was just going zip line to zip line to zip line to zip line rather than flying around 
More caves. I kind of agree with that one. That's a solid one. I feel like the way that caves work in this game is I, you either find like 10 of them in one area or you find none of them, which makes it really difficult. Oh, yeah, the legendary tools. Yeah, we did get leaked once for the rift biome or what's well, a dark forest biome with rift stuff whenever that happens. Hopefully that comes soon. A repair torch? A re oh, a repair torch or repair cars. Oh, that's actually a good one. I kind of like that. Rare meats. A mini map. I don't know, Flota. What's going on, Jamie? If you guys are just joining into the chat, type in one item that you think that LEGO Fortnite needs right now that we do not have in the game. Just do not be very bland about it because I love everything that I see right now. Boss map battles is definitely something I want to see exactly like the um, exactly like what we were kind of talking about with raids. That would be awesome. Radio in your car music would be very cool as well. The only thing that I'm kind of against when it comes to the minimap is taking up part of my UI. So if I could turn that off personally, I would be okay with it. A treasure map, that would be really cool if they brought in or introduced like some, uh, what was it, season eight type of stuff would be very, very cool. New building colors, definitely. I would definitely love that. Air travel and boats, we kind of have that. But yeah, if they added like prefabs for that, that actually worked for sure. And yeah, we do have the compass. I also saw somebody say, um, I also saw somebody say that they wanted like, um, oh, watch out, watch out, watch out. Oh, I can't even land this thing. Uh, I can't land this thing, yo. Oh man, that's gonna be crazy. All right. We will try our best to, to make it while trying to land this thing. Solar panel to charge batteries. That would be really cool as well. A lot of your ideas are, are, are pretty good. I like, I, I like, the, the, the chat right now with all the different ideas. Add pets. I think we're going to get pets. I think we're going to get the pets. Don't know when. Slingshots with rocks. Yo, that would only be useful for friends. That's a good one, Druv. Oh, definitely, Shmoo. That was a, that was a thing I saw a YouTuber. I'm, how am I going the opposite way? I literally came from this way. Which way did I... I need to be going... I came from that way? Oh, I did. Okay. Yeah, something I saw another YouTuber talk about was how pointless some of the chests are in the game. So if you guys see, like, chests that would be, like, on top of this mountain all the way up here, it's completely pointless up there. Same with, like, some of the chests. So, like, this chest that's right here, pointless. The chest that will come in there, pointless. So hopefully they go ahead and they fix some of that stuff as well. A dungeon would be really cool. Horses, I think we will be getting those at some point in time. Definitely soon. Taming wolves would be really cool as well. A hardcore feature, I would love that. I need a hardcore feature. I'm definitely with that. Yeah, supply drops really do. They always have horrible items that nobody cares about. So hopefully Epic kind of, you know, takes the hint with that and they remove some of that stuff and only really give us stuff that matters. Because, yeah, a lot of the time we don't get anything. Hoverboard, that'd be cool, but... The thing that kind of the, the thing that kind of gets me like when it comes to a lot of the stuff that I know that we request is like if we're going to get a hoverboard then the entire game has to change. Like okay, think about a lot of the stuff that you guys are seeing or, or like when you if you guys are typing in chat or if you guys are reading the chat about different things that we could add into the game to make Lego Fortnite better, just try to think about the current way that the game works and if what you're saying would actually kind of fit, right? Like when people are saying pets Pets would work right now, right? Pets would be fine because you already have a villager that you can like carry along with you. So being able to carry a pet with you would also work and be cool. However, like we're talking about different things like a hoverboard or something. Like that just doesn't fit right now like with this stuff, right? It doesn't fit. So you need, you know, kind of specific things based on what is currently in the game or available, you know? I did, Casper. The only reason why I don't have mine set to that right now, um, I think I'm going to park my thing like right here and then jump down and collect some wood. And then I can jump right back on top of one of these trees and uh, land my stuff. The only reason why I don't do that is in order to land my stuff or like to land my uh, thing, I need a, uh, what's it called? 
In order to land my thing, I need wood. I also got the annoying uh, stamina glitch again. Yeah, they did announce or they did do a survey saying that that would eventually be a thing as mods in the game, which would be awesome. So hopefully we do get that pretty soon. Hopefully. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully we get that pretty soon. All right. Now let's get back on our thing. Bang. And we are good to go. Rockets to fly a new planet. Mars and more. Yeah. Let me tell you something. Kristen, let me just say this, okay? If we're talking... If we're talking about going the new planets, we are very behind. Let's go down and break this rock right here, okay? Let's go down and break this rock. So this is one of the chests that I'm talking about. This is also like a little special statue. Uh, it doesn't do anything or give anything too special. Yeah, uh, Terror, that was another thing that kind of got leaked. But look at... Oh, there's a power cell inside of that. I'm breaking your thing. Get away from me, you bums. Hold on, let me get out of here. The Great Escape. There was a power cell in that. There's a power cell inside of the thing. Do you guys see that? I got a power cell from inside one of the chests. We were just talking about the loot not being good enough in them. But maybe the loot got updated? I doubt that anybody would know because there's no way that anybody is going up and opening up those chests. But it did look maybe they fixed them. Maybe they made them decent. Did they make them decent, Shmoo? You like the new upkeep? That's what I'm talking about, just uh, bus mate. I like it as well. Oh, uh, what's going on, Veer? Let's go. Thank you so much, Druv. You don't gotta call me Crafty Bear, though. That guy called me Crafty Bear, yo. Uh, let's see. I could pass by that one chest that I had down there as well and just grab the extra stuff. Yeah, the grapple glitch does still work. Yeah, more animals and stuff. I do hope that we get that. I mean, we got a bunch of them leaked. And uh, I hope that we start getting them a little bit sooner. I hope we get a lot of this stuff sooner than later. I think everybody knows that. Buzzmate, somebody might have uh, gifted you one. Adopt you, man. That ain't the way I adopted nobody. I already got one son. There's no way I am taking on another one. Uh, I did not. I did not get a brand new recipe. I just have... Um, my map is constantly telling me every single time that I log out and log back in, it's like, hey, you got to uh, re-grab this stuff. Yeah, Shang, I was going to. The only problem is in order to land this, I have to go ahead and throw down my wood foundations into the center to make it a little bit easier. So because of that, it makes it a little bit more difficult for me to uh, put down a seat. I don't mind using the thrusters like this, though. It just kind of makes me feel like I'm playing OG Lego Fortnite where you had to do it, you know? The luminous fish yet. I didn't know that was a thing. What is that? Lightning. You hope my monorail breaks. That's not very nice, Drov. I don't even have a monorail. Dang, big graphics got kicked. My boy said he got kicked. What'd you get kicked from, son? Look at those emotes, Ilham. Yeah, I got to fix those emotes as well. And I got to make some new ones as well. If you guys have any ideas on what we could do for emotes. Make sure that you guys let me know. Don't forget to add me as a friend as well. Like I said, guys, I don't mind if you guys add me as a friend. Just please do not spam me with invites. That is my only thing when it comes to that stuff. You guys can add me as a friend. I will gift you something in the future, maybe, potentially. I've been gifting a lot lately, but I will not be gifting you if you spam me with invites. So please do not spam me with invites, please. All right, we're going to go and check some of these chests real quick while we're right here. Because this is my old loot down there. So let's go ahead and let's land this bad boy. Or at least get it close to landing. What I played before LEGO came out? Um, before LEGO came out, I played League of Legends a lot. I did play BR as well. So nothing good inside of here. I played BR a lot too much. Um, League of Legends. Overwatch. Some other stuff just like that which is cool a lot a lot of like competitive style games okay so in this one we did not get a um shell 
which is unfortunate. But in that one, we did get. See, Dignitize, that's what I'm talking about, pal. Do not sit there and start spamming with invites. That's how you get that boot. All right, we don't need that. We'll bring this along with us. The charms, I also don't feel like we need in here. But we also don't need that wool. We also don't need the snowberries. And we also don't need those seeds. So I think that we're good just running this inventory here along with we'll just carry the 50 granite just so I don't have to go ahead and do that. So now we are officially finished here. I appreciate that so much, Float or Flota. Sorry if I pronounced your name wrong. Yeah, Dana emote. Yeah, I, I might I might get something like that. I appreciate you stopping in, uh, just bus mate. When's the next Hunger Games starting? Whenever my map gets approved, man. I've been trying to get this map approved for a tournament, and they sat there and they approved it once, and they've declined it every single time. Every single time they've declined it. Let me refresh and look at what they've done this time. It's still in review since 4 o'clock, so... Uh, Dana is my stalker in-game. So there's a, there's a player in the game named Dana. She's just a villager in the game. And for whatever reason, she uh, loves me and she is obsessed with me. And she follows me around the map no matter where I go. And she doesn't live at my village. She doesn't have a bed in my village. But she is always at my village. And I've removed her. I've put her in jail. I've done a lot of things and she just keeps coming back. So, I don't know. I don't know. I hope I can get rid of her at some point in time. Now, this is my other base here, which I don't use very much. But that's my castle base. If you guys like the castle build, this is the one that I built uh, like a week or two ago. Which looks really nice. I do like the look of it. It's very bright. It stands out. It pops a little bit. I like it a lot. But the one thing that I don't like about it is the price. But hopefully they change that. We don't have to worry about that. So we're almost back at our home village. And the new vehicle worked like a charm. Right? Can we all agree that the new vehicle worked awesome outside of this little jitter that it has right now? Yeah, it will make... Yeah, I, I've mentioned it a few times. But yeah, the steering wheel would make it a little bit easier. The problem is, though, and I'll show you guys this. I mean, I could extend this and make this a little bit larger as far as, like, my aircraft goes. But the way that my aircraft goes right now is I use the wood foundations to land it. So I'll put these directly in the middle, and that'll land the vehicle for me. You know, which makes it very easy. I also love how the second I'm talking about this working like a charm, it's going to break. But... I go ahead and I use these turning things because it's a little bit easier for me right now. Yeah, they would, Corbin. They did it before, so I assume that they'd do it again. But we'll see. I still cannot believe that I just said that this worked like a charm and then it breaks on me. Like, there's no way, right? Uh, I didn't make a video on the wrench just yet. I was I was going to for a YouTube short, and then I realized that the wrench is honestly kind of pointless in a way. Did it, like, is this for real, though? The second that I mentioned that this is good, it breaks like this? I'm going to back out and go back in and see if that fixes it. Oh, I should have just done that, Tear. Sometimes I sit there and I read your guys' comments just a second too late. Yeah, Dana probably really was using the force to stop me from going back. Alright, so these new items still have not been added into the set. I believe they come in at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. These brand new item sets that were gifted to me by Epic earlier today. Here's the brand new Fortnite crew that got added. I guess that's cool. I like the cat a little bit better, honestly. Yeah, you could sit on... Yeah, you could put a plane down on there, but you could also... Uh, I appreciate that, Druff. A Lady Gaga skin giveaway. Come on, Hedgy. Are you for real right now? I'd gift you the Lady Gaga skin. How about that? Yeah, she really is, like, stopping me from getting my, my stuff home. 
She's like, oh, if you're not going to make me a bed, then I'm going to prevent you from coming back. That's exactly what she's doing for sure. Need her to get it together. Okay, zero with the dot. An areas giveaway. Come on, what are we talking about now? An areas giveaway? Nah, not right now, Robert. I've given away so many things in this last week, dude. There's just no way. At the rate that I'm going, I'll be bankrupt in a week. All right, so I left and I came back, and this is still broken. Let's put this on here. There we go. Let's break. Let's see if Tear is right. Tear is right. This is why. This is why Tear is an OG dog. That's why Tear is an OG. So yeah, what I use right now is the wrench on my thrusters, and that helps me, uh, you know, move around a little bit easier. Uh, Crafty and Kaz collab. I'll tell you, me and him are not in contact with each other, but. He did shout me out in a video once. I know that he's a nice guy, so who knows? Hey, you can never say never with certain things, and that is one of the things that probably and could happen one day. Maybe you guys influence that to happen. Who knows? Maybe maybe you guys say, like, hey, let this happen. All right, we're going to have that land on the house. Uh, I just, I just don't like saying last names is the problem. You know what I mean? I, I would shout out anybody or at least say hi to anybody, but I don't want to shout out last names. It gets a little bit crazy when you start doing that. All right, let's go ahead and get ourselves set up. So we did go ahead and we got the snow. Only thing that we need now is going to be the juicer. And once we have the juicer, then we are good to go. So we just need the juicer. And then that'll unlock all of those things for us. So if you guys haven't done that yet, make sure that you guys go ahead and you grab snow, which is found obviously inside of the shore biome. And then inside of there, you guys can just simply dig and you guys will get everything that you need from that. So I got a ton of snow just to have really. I mean, it doesn't really serve much purpose to me right now, but I do have it. Yeah, you just have to click the thrusters, but if you just get the steering wheel, I don't believe that you have to click the thrusters, which makes it obviously just a little bit easier. It's funny that you could melt the glass and get, uh, melt the sand and get glass, but you can't melt the snow and get hot chocolate. You know what I mean? What I said didn't make any sense. That's what I mean. Thank you guys for paying attention. Good on, friend. Storm so fast? It's really not. I slowed it down a little bit. It's because you're playing on the un, uh, the only version of my map at this point is the old one that does not work very well, which is why we are resubmitting it and trying our best to get that going. Cyper, once again, with the gifted membership, and it went to Corbin. Couldn't have gone to somebody better inside of this chat. Shout out to Corbin. Yeah, the map just keeps getting declined, man. I'm trying. I want it to get fixed, but they just keep declining. Do I still have my juicers up here? No, I do not. I do not have them. Snow definitely is yummy. I like how this is right by my front door. Let's get out of here. Thank you. See you later. Alrighty. Let's get our juicers going, and then we are good to go. Plank, marble slab, and not root rod. We got all of those things on us. All right, not root. And that, we'll grab a little bit more plank. We'll build a few of these juicers just for the fun of this. The game is still not out yet. Yeah, still not out. 209 people watching. Shout out to the 209 inside the chat, yo. 209 watching me on the brand new update. I got to impress you guys a little bit, right? If you guys are not subscribed, you guys didn't leave a stream, make sure that you guys leave a like on the stream. I am a hashtag epic partner. Just working on becoming one of the best content creators that I can become and uh, having fun. So a few things that we got in this update is the brand new snow stuff. I will show you guys the garage in just a second. Uh, I got the snow berry ice cream, which you unlock simply by grabbing snow, which is really nice. And then uh, the snow comes from the snow biome or the frostlands biome simply by using a shovel in that area. 
That is all that you need to do in order to get snow, which will unlock the snowberry ice cream, which gives 17 hearts, fills five hunger, and reduces temporary heat for 10 minutes, which is really nice. Then you get the spicy ice cream, which is the same exact thing, except now it's eight hearts, five food, and then 10 minutes of anti-cold, which is nice. Then you just have the regular ice cream, which is five hearts and five food, which is very, very nice. So I want to go ahead and let's, uh, let's make some of this stuff. All right, Florida, I will catch you, uh, catch you later, man. Thank you for tuning into the stream. So in order to make the snowberry bucket, we need milk and snowberry. Then we need milk and spicy peppers. And then we just need a milk. And the good thing is that I am somebody that hoards all of my stuff very nice and neatly. So I have milk. I also have spicy peppers. And I also have snowberries inside of my thing. So I believe that I can make all of these things, which is really nice. So I'll assign the recipe. We'll make one of these. We will make one of these. And we will make just a regular ice cream as well. Just so we can enjoy a little bit of ice cream. So we will go ahead and throw that in there as well. Oh, so that hasn't even started yet. Has it? Has this started yet? Yeah, resources, two out of two. What is going on? Three? Why is this not started yet? Oh, I didn't add three snow. My bad, yo. I'm out here tripping. I'm like, why is this not started yet? Three snowberry as well. That gets started. And then the ice cream is three snow. And we are good to go. I do have Fortnite crew. Yep. Which is really nice. I think it's well worth it. Okay. So this is all of the brand new foods that we're about to go ahead and create. We just unlocked every single one of them. And we are going to go ahead and eat some of the brand new snow stuff. That way you guys can just watch me eat snow, which is awesome. Who doesn't like watching other people just eat snow? I'll throw the snow inside here because it's absolutely useless after I go ahead and eat this stuff. Um, I do keep my stuff extremely, extremely organized. If you guys don't know... Being organized is the best way to play this game because it helps a ton. Favorite car in Lego? None of them right now. I went ahead and I tried all of the vehicles. They just did not seem to work very well. Uh, they're just a little bit bugged right now. So again, it is the first day of the update being out. So there's going to be stability fixes and things like that that will go ahead and help. So I have all of my stuff completely set up. Let's go ahead and grab myself my snowberry ice cream let's grab a spicy ice cream and let's grab a regular ice cream and we could look at it while looking over our garage so we have the epic the rare and the uncommon ice creams here which are very 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 nice let's go down here to our garage so this is the garage that we have i appreciate that so much fred yeah i'm so organized i am the villagers, uh, there's a few different ones. Like, Lynx is one of them. I got uh, Lynx here. He uh, doesn't know how to get through walls, unfortunately. But, yeah, the brand new villagers, and they also come with a brand new job, which can give you the biomass and fertilizer and stuff like that, which is uh, really, really cool. Because that biomass can go right into my current stuff. So, I did build this, which is very, very nice. And now I have it all set up. So, yeah, so this is my garage right now. I got two cars in it. The truck broke, so we got rid of the truck. We'll build another one here shortly. Hopefully, they do fix it. Lynx is a girl. Okay. Yeah, Lynx is a girl. You know. All right. So, we're cold right now. So, we do have the spicy ice cream, which is the all red one. And we eat it. Not the coolest of animations, I guess. It looks like I'm eating all cone. I just ate all cone. Handle that, Hedgy. You know what I mean? Come on. Hedgy, you're better than this. You know what I mean, Hedge? All right. So that was kind of... I'm not... Listen, you know, I know it's like... I know it's kind of nitpicky, but... I know it's kind of nitpicky, but why was I eating all cone? I should be sitting here digging deep into the actual ice cream. Am I right? Should I not have been digging directly into that ice cream? I mean, it filled it, it, filled it up pretty good. What's going on, Bagel? And then you just have the regular ice cream. But again, look, you're eating all cone. All cone. 
And then you have the Snowberry Ice Cream, which is the epic one. This one gives you the most hearts and fills the most hunger. This one, once again, all cone, which is unfortunate, but nonetheless still fills you up. And it also looks like I, could have, I have 10 minutes of anti-heat and 10 minutes of the anti-cooling, which is really nice. Yeah, yay for the Aries bundle. I don't even know what you're talking about, TJ. Yeah, I just come all over my forehead. That's why my forehead be pink. You feel me? How do you get the new villagers? You just got to wait for them. Honestly, you just got to wait. I, I I sat outside just kind of hoping that they would come, but I only got one of them, and I have not seen another villager yet. Like, Spark Plug comes around. Dana comes around. Doug, what are... What are we doing? What is this? What are you looking at? Yo, buddy. Hey, there you go. All right. What are you looking at? All right. Cool. All right. So and another thing that they added in this update, which was really cool, if you guys didn't know, it is the magnet pickup. So before you kind of had to run up and you had to press your E in order to grab stuff which was, you know, super annoying. Gra you know, pressing your E in order to grab things just weren't wasn't like the most amount of fun. Now, when you just walk over them, you can see it magnets into your inventory, which is really cool. I also have the illuminator charm or equipment, which keeps it light around me at all times, so it's never too, too, too dark. And then they also went ahead and they added in the ability just to have brand new and random stuff around the map. So now you guys will see that on like the shore biome, you're going to have more docks put around. This one isn't that cool, but this one does have some copper bars here that I can go ahead and get. So I got four copper bars out of that random fishing dock thing that was right here. And you could still use this because they will put fishing areas around this dock, but... um. I, I don't know if that's true, Nate, because I just auto-picked up those bones and I did not kill a, uh, a thing. But maybe you're talking about like when you're breaking wood and stuff like that, for sure. Um, but yeah, so you're going to have these random fishing docks all over the place now. You can see that I have this one here. And then on the other side of my map, across the way near my Durburger setup, I have another one over there. And you could use these not only, obviously, for more copper bars and stuff like that, if you don't have that in the game, although I believe a lot of us have, like, a large influx of copper bars because they gave us a ton of it. But the other thing that's really nice about it is you also just now have brand new fishing docks that you could use while you guys are fishing, right? And they're going to go ahead and they're going to make sure they put new stuff around them. And, yeah, I did see that, uh, Cruz. I saw that somebody, I believe it was Tear, said that when you're going around... It's, it almost kind of sounds like the Dark Forest sound bites that we heard before. What's going on, Wolf Dog? Three large sets of chopper and obsidian. Yeah, same, Shang. I did a glitch a long time ago that helped with all of that. And then, like, ever since, I've just been stacked on that stuff, which is very, very, very nice. Locked in. Let's go, Michael. Yeah, I would I would love to do that uh, Fortnite con Martin. The the problem is like there there's a few issues when it comes to it. Number one, like a video like that would yeah the dupe glitch from a while back. That's what I did. The problem with and I, I would love to. I think it would be so much fun if you guys are in full screen. You guys didn't see what he said. Uh, he said that it'd be cool if I went in and um if if I went in and I ranked or I viewed people's bases and villages and stuff like that. I've done it before where we did a video uh, about that pretty much. The problem was, number one, the video did not perform very well because those videos don't do very well. They're more of like, they're more fun, like as far as like a community thing goes than they are like actually doing well. But um, the other side of that is like, it is just a very lengthy thing to do for it to really not do very well. If like viewing people's bases and stuff like that, uh, did very well on YouTube as well as it didn't take so long to do, then I would love to do it, but it takes way too much time to do. And unfortunately, it doesn't actually do very well on YouTube. So nonetheless, though, um, so it says, what's wrong with my purple lights? Some people have purple lights and some people don't. Mine, which were purple at one point, no longer are purple for whatever reason. So hopefully they fix that, uh, revert them back to purple. 
if that's even a thing. And if they don't, then, you know, whatever. Yeah, a giveaway tournament could be cool, yeah. Um, I was going to do, like I said, I have the one tournament that I want to do. But again, the problem is, like, even if I announce it as, like, a giveaway tournament, like, still, like, there's no viewership or anything there, so, which is unfortunate. Uh, yeah, Nick, they do, uh, they do, uh, you know, just randomly spawn at your village. If you want some new ones, what I recommend doing is just getting rid of some of them. And you may see some new ones popping up. Um, like spark plug never came to his village before until today. He's here now. He's not somebody that I would have, although it makes sense that he would be a, uh, mechanic. What's going on, Luke? But I don't have, uh, some of the other people that I would like to get as well. Who I should get soon, hopefully. But the, we will see. Uh, the one thing I guess I could do is add on to the aircraft. And maybe we can work on building an aircraft. I'm not too good at building aircrafts. Which is, you know, the downside of me. Is I don't know how to build aircrafts. Yeah, Shangen, unfortunately, like, same exact thing. Just would not perform very well on YouTube. So it's like... I, I can't even do prop hunt videos because people don't like them. Like, people don't like prop hunt videos either. So I just have to be, like, real specific about what I upload on YouTube because some people don't like it. I don't know if removing the village square will help you get the new villagers. I I'm not sure. I normally just wait. I wouldn't remove the village square unless you had all the materials, obviously, very quickly to, um, you know, get it all back. But personally, I wouldn't. But I'm sure that is something that does work. Let's go Zets. Oh, you got the white Batmobile we made? Okay, I definitely got to check that. Which charms do I recommend? The charms, if you guys are not doing it, I would go ahead and run three regeneration charms. It's by far the best thing to run in the game. It's the easiest thing to do. Spark plugs your girl too. They're all girls, okay? I just call people dudes and guys. You know, it is what it is, man. Like, they got to figure it out. Um, But let's go ahead and build like a... a a tougher vehicle that we could add like chest onto and, and things like that and see uh, maybe that would work a little bit better because right now my aircraft is cool but it's just not great right yeah two regeneration charms and then one of you know like a certain area would be cool as well but it's all it's all up to you I, I just run three regeneration charms because it's the easiest but you can genuinely do like whatever you want to do with it Uh, make a food truck. Yeah, I could make a food truck. That'd be cool, actually. A little food truck action could be pretty dope. How many? I don't know. Uh, what does everybody think about the uh about the update? I know I asked that earlier, but I know there's probably new people in here. If you guys haven't answered that question yet or haven't been asked that question yet, what does everybody think of the brand new update? Do you guys like it? Hate it? My opinion on it is like you know, hey, it's good. It's not great. Could be better, but could be much worse. I'm happy that we got something added into the game, which is always nice. Can't really complain about, like, getting new stuff in the game. Although there's some people that will complain. 8 out of 10. That's probably a good uh, a good area to be. 8 out of 10 makes sense to me. I'm kind of probably in that same area. 8 out of 10. It's good. Not great. Good enough for me, though. All right, Evie. No problem, brother. I appreciate you. All right. We're going to go three up. Three up here. Right? Bang. And then we're going to place down our dynamic foundation just like that. Right. You finally see your aircraft. Yeah, that's the biggest thing for me as well. Searing your aircraft is awesome. I'm happy that you it's also like it. Oh, okay, cool. Siri just said that she likes to feel, uh, be appreciated. That's awesome. Thank you, Siri. I'm glad that you also like to be appreciated. I'm sure that was just Dana on my phone or something like that. Acting all weird, Joe. All right, so let's get this on to that right there. I think those are attached, right? Are these attached? I hope so. All right, let's get to work on these. I want to build a pretty nice aircraft here. So if you guys can help me, let's do it. First things first, I would like to do is add some of the brand new toy stuff that's on here. So adding on the large front area would be nice if i could add this onto here let's do that yep we'll add that onto the front bang bang yep add that onto the front what else we got to add on this bad boy 
We're going to have a lot of area for balloons as well to throw onto here. Let's throw our beams on here as well, just to get myself like, you know, set up properly. That way, when they hit me from underneath, I am good to go. Can I get out of the way, please? Yes. 30 minutes until the brand new store is live, by the way. What have I made so far? Not Nothing really. Not, not too much. I haven't made, you know, much of really anything, but... We're going to go ahead and make a brand new vehicle here uh, with you guys so we can check some of this out. I don't know how heavy I can make it because I know that vehicles will break in the air, right? That's the one thing that kind of makes me nervous about it. It's like one there, one there, one there, and one there, right? But would this be too heavy? Like, would this be too big? Because if I put chests onto all four of these, would that be too large then or what? Oh, geez, Dyer, but you know what? A wise man once said, this was a wise man that said this. It wasn't me. I'm serious. I'm, no, I'm so serious. It was not me. A wise man once said that you could never have too much biomass. I don't know who said it, but somebody said it, I'm sure. Somebody said it, I'm, I'm sure. The thing on the front, let me be honest with you, it really doesn't help with much, okay? It's supposed to tank a little bit of damage. That's why I put it there. It should tank a little bit of damage, so I put it there, and I'm hoping for the best on it. All right, Cruz, I'll catch you later, brother. Farm for life, son. Yeah, all right, Hedgy, yeah. So the thing on the front should help a little bit with damage, but not too, too much. It should tank, like, a little bit. Like, if I hit a tree or something like that, it might break, but... It's just something to put on the front just for like kind of design purposes and whatnot. I want to see if I can just, I just want to set this up like clean. You know, I want it to look nice. I want it to be perfect. All right. I want to try to use as much of the new building parts as I possibly can. So like even like the vehicle railing, like I could put these like all over, but my problem is it might just be a little bit too heavy. Yeah. Large balloons in the middle. That's a good idea. Large balloons in the middle. Can I get this to work? Time to go on controller now. All right. Time to go on controller because this is not working the way that I want it to. I can't put one right there. Cool beans. Awesome. Nothing better than not being able to put them right there, but that's okay. Right here. Not enough resources, so I need more railings. Oh, absolutely. I think, I, I think I'm still going to be streaming. Streaming for a while tonight. Brand new update. You know, you got to be streaming. You're not streaming with the new update. What are you doing? You're falling behind. Oh, let's go, Asian girl. That's what I'm talking about. Asian girl always comes in clutch when it comes to a lot of the brand new content that's added into the game. So if you guys have not checked it out, make sure that you guys do. I don't know. I don't know, Dyer. Do you really think that the... I know it's, I, I know obviously it's mainly opinion, but do you really think that the, uh, do you really think that the compass is that important? Because like, to me, I'm going to be honest with you. I, I know that the compass is like important. I just don't use the compass all that much. Like personally, I just don't use it all that much. Let's go blogs. My guy finally caught a live stream. You love to see it. Thank you so much, Bamboo. Uh, maybe um, I I might I'm not I'm just not entirely sure just yet. Um, I'm not very good when it comes to aircrafts and stuff like that, so I'm just kind of building this on the fly, like building what I think could look nice, kind of testing the limits of the new update and see exactly what goes on within the new update. So we'll see what's going on, Doodles. Not enough resources again, dude. I'm just going to build this gate like all the way around this. And then we're going to see exactly what goes on. Lego F1 car. That sounds pretty dope. A Lego F1 car. Is it faster than an F1 car? Is it as fast as one? All right, Hedgy, can you handle that, buddy? You know what I mean? Hedgy, you know what I mean. And do a little bit of handling or schmoo or any mods that are inside of here. Help out a little bit with some of that. Uh, trying to help with a rocket ship. Yeah, rocket ship would be really cool. I hope that they drop some things that are that are good for that. 
Boba Power Cell Maker. Hell yeah. When's the next update? Probably two weeks from today. So if today is Tuesday 26th, the next one should be April 9th. What would the next update be? Not sure. You know? Not sure what it would be, but it would be something along the lines. I I'm thinking that we get like a part two to this update. I think we're going to get a part two of the update here that'll bring you different air vehicles and different things like that. I think that's probably the next step for uh, Epic with, with this. Cyper with another five gifted memberships. Thank you so much, Cyper. I appreciate you so, so much. So many nice people in this community. I try my best to say thank you to everybody. But if you guys were just gifted a sub membership by my guy Cyper, make sure you guys shout him out. Thank him inside of the chat. One of my nicer people inside of my community that we've built right here. Appreciate you so, so much. If you guys are inside of the stream and are not part of the Discord, but are looking for a nice little home, a nice little community to be a part of, make sure that you guys join the Discord. It's just exclamation point Discord or discord.gg forward slash crafty plays. Yeah, it's normally when the next, uh, it's normally two weeks every Tuesday. So hopefully, 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 hopefully. Look, she, look, she's back. That's what I'm talking about. Every single stream, she's here. It's unreal. I want a new villager, but I keep having Dana come back. So what am I supposed to do? You know what I mean? What am I supposed to do when Dana comes back every single stream? She's just a weirdo. All right, let's remove these. I'm going to allow you to walk in through this back area, I believe. Underwater update? Yeah, that would be cool. Do I think that we're going to get that anytime soon? Unfortunately, probably not. But hey, you never know with Epic what you're going to get. And that's, a, you know, and listen, that's the truth. You never know what you're going to get with Epic. Let's just keep it real. You never know. Vehicle stairs. This would probably be too much because I guess this wouldn't be too bad. Uh, it would because you can't land like flat. So I don't need vehicle stairs. I appreciate that so much, Drev. Although I'm I'm sure I know exactly who you are, regardless. Making a tank would be absurd. No. Make a tank. Gonna bite a life. Yeah, head you need to get it together, yo. I didn't mean to delete our world, okay? I really, I didn't mean to. It just happened. It was unfortunate. I didn't do it on purpose. It just happens. And let's be honest. You guys weren't going to continue to play anyway, okay? Let's let's not act like I did, like, the worst thing in the world. You know? AT&T at, at Walker from Star Wars. Sorry, I did not watch. Never watch the Star Wars, believe it or not. You guys can hate me right now. You Beginning right now, you guys are allowed to hate me because I just said that to you guys. I'm sorry. But yeah, um, I did um, I did delete a world that I had with some friends while we were prepping, thinking that we were going to get a brand new Rift biome and whatnot, which is really cool. Yo, shout out Mech for sending hate. Shout out to him. Um... But we had, I, I, I fully expected us to get a brand new biome. That's what like, you know, the leaks and everything said. Thought we are going to get a brand new biome. We did not get it, which was unfortunate. Dog, hey, from Australia? Come on, man. All the way from Australia? But I, I went ahead and I deleted our world by accident. It happens. It happens to the best of us. In my case, the worst of us. Whittily. All right. Where am I from? East Coast. Originally from New Jersey. Originally from New Jersey. I need to get some lights on here. I think I just do regular candles, but... Do I just do regular candles or do I try to put these on? Oh, these bad boys on here, though. Hold on. I'll put these bad boys on here? Hold on. Oh, son. Look at this. Hold on. Am I cooking in the crock pot right now? Hold on. Am I cooking? Am I am I cooking? Hold on. Is this am I the goat? Hold on. 
I don't know. I might not be the goat, but I definitely, I definitely, uh, de I definitely, uh, des I definitely describe the description of the goat. I'm trying to build a large aircraft. Okay, I've never built like an actual large aircraft, so I wanted to try to go ahead and do it. Love from Dare and Mario. That's what I'm talking about. What about the car headlights? Oh yeah, I could have just done that. What was I thinking? The car headlights probably would have actually fit. The car headlights actually would have made sense. Why didn't I build? Why didn't I build those? Why aren't you guys helping me? What are you guys doing in the stream if you're not helping me? Lock it in, okay? Lock it in. Light bar, angled light bar. So I need glass. Lock it in, guys. Get it together. Bagel's making a boat. Good luck, man. Good luck. I don't I don't like the idea of a boat personally, but if it's something you're going to like to do, then uh, do it. I just don't think a boat is very useful right now in the game unless they give us more stuff like on the shore biome or they give us like some underwater stuff or, or something like that. Like water caves or something like that would be really cool, but... How many deserts in one world, dude? It's like a million. Not actually a million, but it's like there there is a large amount in uh in there. I'm afraid that this is just gonna fall off. I'm gonna put these here, but I think these are just gonna fall off. Yeah, these are definitely gonna fall off. I'm gonna put them here. These aren't gonna last very long. Can we all keep it honest with me? Can you guys keep it honest? Yeah, these are falling off. Are we really gonna pretend like these will stay? Let's have mad lights on the front. We might as well use as much torches and glass as we can because we have such an influx of it, right? Let's just do it. Put so many lights up here that we just shine everywhere while we're flying. Blind the opposition with our lights, right? Lynx, what's up, pal? What do you what do you got for me, Lynx? What are, you, what are you scratching your head for? What do you got for me? Are we blind our opposition with those lights? Put them above. No. He gave me one egg, dude. Th yeah, thank you. Oh, and, and poop. Thank you so much. I appreciate that so much. And put some lights underneath on this side as well. Do we just make this look as ugly as possible? Like, yo, Crafty, you cook, man. And then I just make the ugliest thing imaginable. Am I right? You need a plane tutorial? This is not the place to be. <laughs> this is I'm working on making like the ugliest thing of all time. I think I'm just kind of gonna I'm building this kind of like kind of like a, a UFO almost. It's like the direction I think I'm in right now. This is gonna be a bright flying saucer, I could tell you that much. Yeah, UFO. Okay, at least hey, you know what? In a way, that's kind of what I'm going for now. Was I going for it originally? No. Am I going for it now? May as well. You know, a little UFO action up in here. Let's do it. Um, and then once this is done, we could add the balloons on top and then we are good to go. We will see how this all goes on. Lynx glows in the dark. I didn't even know that he glows in the dark or she glows in the dark. Sorry. She, before Shamu or somebody corrects me, she... This entire row is off. Oh, man. Get it together, dude. I'm going to break this whole thing by accident. I know it. I know I'm going to break the whole thing by accident. I know I'm going to break the whole thing by accident. I know it. 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 I'm going to break the whole thing by accident. Like you guys didn't see that You guys didn't see that No, you guys did not see that Nope, you guys didn't see that Cool Alright Let's get down to finishing these lights real quick And then we will get going on the rest of the actual Get going on the rest of the vehicle here I don't even know if this vehicle is going to work And if it doesn't work, I'm going to feel like an absolute moron building this
Oh, now everybody wants to build. Now everybody wants to bring up the car jacks. Now that I'm now that I'm already halfway done. Now you guys want to bring up the car jacks? Yeah. That oh now everybody now everybody's a car jacking pro. That's what it is. You waited till I was done. No, Spicy, let me tell you something. The one thing you don't want to see out of me is a face cam. You don't want to see this face. You don't want to see this face. All right? That's something you don't want to see yet. Probably never, actually. You don't ever want to see this face. Make a scooter? That'll be cool. I'm waiting for people to make, like, motorcycles and stuff like that. I know that people are trying to build them. I just wonder how useful they'll actually be. That's, like, the most important thing. It's your with a apostrophe e uh, r e actually. Why is, why are these in there? What the heck was I doing? Storage room? Hell yeah, dude! Listen, there's nothing better in this game. Everybody can sit there; they can say what they want. There's nothing better in this game than being organized. I am extremely extremely organized. I did it all on my own. Some people tried to help me; they actually messed it up. I would say they actually didn't help at all. That's me completely lying. What did I come in here to try to grab? I just came in here to grab something. I completely forgot what it was. What I need... Oh. Alright, I need to go ahead and build some of these large chests and see exactly how they hold up. So, we have this. And then we also need oh, frost pine and iron bars. Frost pine, iron bars. I can do those very, very easily. Iron bars here. Frost pine. Lego GTA roleplay server. Could you imagine? That would actually kind of be funny, yeah? The problem would be like it would just be a little bit too hectic. A little bit too hectic there, Hedgy. I'll put one chest here. Yep. One chest here. Yep. One chest here. Yep. One chest here. Yep. Okay. That looks good to me. We're going to pretend like those are all even. All right. So we got our chest lined up. Now, I'm definitely not the best player ever. I am trying my best, though. Oh, Zets did the motorcycle. Or somebody did the motorcycle. Sorry, I'm just trying to look up. Dyer did the motorcycle. W? Look at this. She wants to come with me. Oh, you want to come with me? I would throw you off this. I would fly so high up and I'd push you right off of it, Dana. All right. What's going on, Lao Fry? All right. So we're going to add balloons in this center area here. And I put a steer uh, seat here as well with our thrusters. Right. So we need thrusters now. And then we're pretty much good to go, right? Balloons we have enough for. Balloons we have enough for. We need thrusters, right? We'll probably do small thrusters and then the activation switch. Wooden rods, and I'm good. I have a ton of wooden rods now. Eight composite bins. Very nice. That's definitely what you need. Four composite bins. I think you need more. Um, eight composite bins. I think you need more composite bins. More composite bins. So many composite bins, you so many composite bins, you don't even know what to do with all the composite bins. Five over there, yep. Um Okay, hold on. We'll do five over here as well. Hold on. Two, three. Um how how did I do that? How did I? Okay. That's not even, but whatever, right? That's not even, but whatever. Then we got to put some on the sides as well. Probably just for like some nice even turning. We'll do two on each side here. Right on the yellow, bang and bang. Right? I think everybody can agree that that makes the most sense, right? Everybody can agree that that does make the most sense. Oh my gosh, I know. Not looking for poop makes this game so much easier. Uh, no, I only I stream exclusively on YouTube. I don't think that streaming on Twitch, especially for Lego Fortnite, is a good idea. Trippy said no. What are you saying no for, Trippy? Trippy? 
Yeah, I don't think the streaming on Twitch right now is good for growing when it comes to LEGO Fortnite. There just unfortunately isn't a lot of stuff that goes on over there on Twitch. It's all Battle Royale, competitive players, mini games and stuff like that. Just, I don't know, I like the YouTube game. YouTube is a lot easier for me over here, you know? Do three for the turning thrusters? Got it. Hey, that's not a problem. I'll do three. You think I won't? You think I won't do three? I will. Three. Look at that. Yup. And then watch this. Bang. Three. What's going on, Kuyan? All right. Now we need to do... Go. Oh, okay. Wrong, wrong thing. Now I need to build my seat. So we'll do my large driver's seat. I need two granite. That should be good. Do I need to use a driver's seat for this? Yeah. How did, can somebody can somebody like in chat kind of like break down how this works as far as the steering wheel on here? Because I genuinely don't know exactly how it works. I know that somebody said that you could add a steering wheel and that'll work just like adding uh, the rest of the stuff. I just don't know how it works. I don't think it does either, Hedgie, but I know that people did mention that you can just do that instead. Because what I would do is I'd put my large steering wheel like right here, right? And I think that would work. Or do I just do a regular seat? Come on, chat. Help a boy out. Do the steering wheel and use the wrench on it. All right. Use the wrench. See, nothing. All right. One, oh, okay. One, two, and three. Okay, so one will be these bad boys back here. Yep, got it. Oh my gosh, we're going to be the best. Who said that I wasn't the best? Who said I, I don't have the game figured out? These will be one. Right? Come on. Be the best, be the best, be the best. That's one. This is two. Okay. And then this is three. So now in theory, that should work, right? I still need three switches or no? Because now I could just press on the steering wheel and I'm fine, right? If I just press the button on the steering wheel. All I need to do now is just use stuff on the steering wheel. So I should be good to go. Okay. So the last thing that I have to do is balloons all over it. And I should be floating. So I'll do a balloon directly in the center behind me, right? One. I'll do a balloon over here, two. Okay. And I'll do a balloon over here, three. And we are flying. Let's go. All right. Let's see how this works. Let's see how this works. R. F. R. F. Okay. C. R. F. Okay. Yeah. Am I the best? Am I the greatest to ever touch this game? Okay, so I kind of like this. I kind of like this. Yeah, do we all agree that this is pretty dope? We all agree that this is like, this is it? I guess now the problem ultimately is like... The problem ultimately is like, now, now how do I get this thing down? How do I get this thing to go down? Like this? Yeah, landing seems to be an issue. I guess I don't need to land all the way though. Oh, break the middle balloon. Oh, that's a good idea. That's a good idea. Let's all right, let's test that. Let's test that. Let's test it. We're going to break the middle balloon and see if this lands. Oh, no. No. <laughs> But it does. Yo. That's what I'm talking about. 
more front how about how about this how about i got how about i got another one for you oh here we go falling down yep thank you for falling down onto me thank you all right how about this how about this how about this how about this what if i build um what if i build a Can can I put does anybody know can I put like can I uh can I put like a staircase or something like like a staircase like like this almost and then put my steering wheel right here am I able to do that like can I put my uh can I put a steering wheel up here and it still work or does it have to be connected to the dynamic foundation does anybody know I can Ooh Ooh, 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 okay. All right. Okay. Now, let me put some magic on this bad boy, huh? Let me put some magic on. Let me put some magic on this bad boy. You ready? Are y'all ready for this? You guys are about to really see some, some cool stuff. Battle pass in four minutes, four minutes, four minutes. Everybody get ready. Four minutes, four minutes. Okay, we'll go with that. We'll move that. Okay. Let's grab all this. Yep. Watch what we're about to do. Oh, man. We're about to make this look crazy, dude. We're about to make it look crazy. What am I cooking? You're about to find out. What am I cooking? What am I cooking? What am I cooking? You're about to find out. Bang. Oh, it's going to be a heavy, heavy hitter. But we're about to make this look so clean, so nice, so beautiful. Dana's going to say, oh, crafty, please. All right, please don't. Nobody clip that, please. But like for us, she really is going to be like, oh, my gosh, crafty. How did you build that? You're so amazing. And I'm gonna be like, yo, Dana, chill. You know what I mean? Like, you're not welcome around here. All right, Dana, chill for a minute. Give me, you know what I mean? I'm like, give me my, give me my space, Dana. You know? That's that's where I'm that's where I'm gonna be with her, you know what I mean? I'm like give me my give me my space, Dana. Now I know this is gonna make my the vehicle extremely heavy. I'm hoping it's just not not too heavy, you know. Let's just hope it's not too heavy to do it. All right, so we have the white, right? And now what we'll do is we'll do the all white stairs. Centered in. Right? Come on. Let Crafty cook. Let Crafty cook. This is centered. Yep. Holy crap. Dude, I'm cooking. I'm cooking so hard right now. All right. Railings. Okay, hold on. Hold on, guys. Let, let Crafty cook. Let me cook. Just let me cook. Come on, I got this. I got this. I got this. Do you guys believe in me? Do you guys believe in Crafty? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Believe in Crafty. I know you do. Do you believe in me? Yeah, you do. Watch me. Oh, my gosh, dude. The greatest. Am I the greatest to ever do it? Am I the greatest to ever do it? Am I the greatest to ever do this? Come on. All right, come on. Come on. Does this not look so good? Am I am I am I lying? Am I lying? Come on, tell me this doesn't look so good. All right, hold on. We got to back out. We got to back out. We got to back out for a second. We got a brand new item shop dropping into the game, guys. What am I aiming for? Just going to make it look nice since I could just put large balloons and stuff like that on there. Just want to make sure that this ship looks nice. I also want it to be able to go ahead and carry some stuff as well um, so that that works. But, uh, guys, if you guys didn't know, you'll fall like that. I hope, like, I hope not. All right, if you guys didn't know, I've said this to you guys before. I am an official Epic Partner now officially so the euphoria volume 2 bundle 
is now inside of the shop. I was gifted all of this stuff earlier. Thank you so much, Moo, for another 10 gifted subs uh, or memberships so that you guys can unlock exclusive content. But inside of the item shop right now is the brand new fresh out bundle. This comes with or is with their brand new uh, collab with the brand new Nike pack. So if you guys have not checked this out, and you guys like the skins that you guys saw on stream, make sure that you guys go ahead and check that out. These skins are pretty cool. They have Lego and they also have Battle Royale sets as well. As far as today goes, they added my bundle in the shop. This is the crafty bundle. Is this not the crafty bundle in the shop? Did they not do this specifically for me? They did the crafty bundle in the shop. Come on, are we... Yo, they did this for me, right? Make sure that you guys are buying anything inside of the shop. You guys are using the code crafty plays. But dude, they, they added... This is the crafty bundle. This is the crafty bundle. They added this in the shop. Right? Am I wrong? Am I wrong or did they add the crafty bundle into the shop? Be honest. Come on. They did this for me, yo. They did this for me. Had to have been for me. Had to have been for me. I'm kidding. That's definitely not for me, guys. I'm lying. I am totally, 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 totally lying. Uh, I want to go up here. I have to... Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Hopscotch. Whiska. I'm going to go ahead and gift this to... Gift this bunny outfit to somebody. Just going to gift that. You know what I mean? Just going to gift that. So yeah, we got brand new stuff inside the store. Obviously, we got the bunny stuff as well. Obviously, with Easter coming along soon. We have the Oro and the Aurelia. We have the Ascendant Midas inside of the shop as well, which looks really cool. The Midas Lego skin does look extremely, extremely cool. Should you get the Trigger Fish or Dur Burger? Depends, man. What do you like? I would say Dur Burger. Unless you guys want to look like me. If you guys want to rock out like me, you guys can use my Triggerfish set. Which is obviously not mine, but we can joke around and say that it is. But again, make sure that you guys are using inside of the shop. Make sure you guys use uh, support a creator code, Crafty Place. Let's go back and let's update and continue to build our main area. Yeah, that is true. You can build a drive through uh, area as well. So if you guys wanted, um, make the loaded diaper van, bro. Jeez, Dyer. The loaded diaper van. God dang, dude. I would say get the trigger fish because it's me. Nah, I wish, I, I wish, Shmoo, that would be really cool if they did that, but I think it would have just been named, like, the Crafty Bundle, but regardless. So, really cool. In the ending of my videos, um, man, I have to look that up for you, because I don't, I don't even remember which one I'm doing. But it would be really cool if they did that for me, but they didn't. But regardless, it's just crazy because today is the day that they gave me exclusive content early. And then the eight o'clock item shop, there is my skin. It has to be for me. And like I said, if you guys are playing, make sure you guys use the creator code crafty plays inside of the shop if you guys are using it. All right, let's get back to uh, let's get back to being crafty inside of here so i have grand chest i want one in every corner so it'd be just like this right one there one there one there and then one final one which is going to be like right here 
Nope, I gotta move that back one spot. I also gotta move those back one spot. Is bones? Yeah, there. It definitely is the best way to do it. The other way that you could do it, which is uh, extremely, extremely, extremely cheap, is if you just put all of your villagers. You could just have your villagers actually make you glass and pretty much power cells. Honestly, you could have them kind of do it all for you. You overcrowded it with grand chests. Yeah, I only. I'm. I'm thinking. I'm just gonna do four. Four grand chest is probably enough for me. I don't think I need much more than that. This is off by a smidge. Come on. Off by a smidge. Just like that, I guess. And now it's too too close on. Man, dude. But I think that this could look really cool. Floating in the sky. There we go. That's better. Lined up perfectly. Hey, let your villagers make the power cells. All that you have to do is put them on the compost job. Once they're on the compost job, then you could also put them on to the uh, the compost job, and then also on the metal smelting job. Those two jobs combined will ultimately give you all of the stuff that you need, which is really cool. All right, we're gonna do this now. Black, just like that can we do this yeah why can i place that there okay like that put another one this one like right here and then this one right here just like that cool i was gonna build this is just like an outline sort of like i i again i doubt that anybody's like copying me inside inside stream and being like oh i want to copy this exact build because this really at the end of the day might not work but this will just help me out a little bit as well when it comes to just like making sure that i have everything lined up inside of here but we'll see there we go okay this is going to help me just when it comes to my balloons and stuff because i can put my balloon here i put another balloon right here and then i'm good to go so I have my thrusters good. I have my steering wheel good as well, which will work on those thrusters. Now I just got to lift myself up into the sky and I should be good to go. Don't rely on the villagers. No, no. You got to rely on the villagers. Got to rely on the villagers, man. The villagers are the number one thing in this entire game. The best thing that you could do in this game is rely on the villagers, making them making them work on stuff that you don't want to work on. Like I don't want to work on metal and glass or and stuff like that. So I have my villagers working on all of that stuff for me. So they're going to work on all of this stuff for me. I have my villagers getting me glass. And then I also have my villagers um, getting me the other stuff as well in order to make sure that I get everything that I want. Yeah, they do take too long, but that's kind of the beauty in keeping yourself busy on the game because if you just go out and if you go out and you go crazy then they're going to do all of the work for you right you just got to go out and um, go out and ball out right like if i go to the snow biome right now by the time i get back they should pretty much have everything locked and loaded they should in theory have everything locked and loaded if I were to leave right now. Oh, I know. Yeah, you do need the power cells uh, to be like that. It really is kind of dumb that it's like that. But at the end of the day, you know, hey, it is what it is. Nothing we could do but complain at the end of the day. All right. So I have everything set up. I also have my beautiful machine right here. The only thing that I could do, like, and this, it would be such a waste is put like the colors on the side as well, but unfortunately it doesn't work very well, but still the white looks so much nicer on top as well. And then if I just put these balloons on here, so one in the direct center, one on the far left, and then one on the far right, doesn't matter what political side you're in, you know? As long as you got the power of balloons, then you're good to go. I can put one like small balloon here, one small balloon there, one small balloon here, and one small balloon here. 
Might be a little bit overkill on the balloons for sure, but I guess we'll see when it comes to breaking. I got everything I think that I need for a decent adventure here. Too much silk fabric, that's for sure. I'm also not as high as I thought that I would be, which is obviously completely fine. So F goes that way. C goes this way. So this will turn myself, which is cool. Just like that. Keep turning, keep turning, keep turning. And then, uh, bang, I'm facing my other village. And now I can go. Bring a sword. I always forget a sword. I just fight people with my, with my other stuff. Does it die? It shouldn't die, in theory. It also goes pretty fast as well. The only thing is I might need another large balloon. I might need another large balloon, yeah? Or more small balloons? Uh, we're tilting! We're tilting towers! Alright, dude, that was cringe. Can you stop? Yes. I apologize for my actions. This might be way too many balloons. Yeah, the nose tipping down because I have to sit up front and just kind of be like myself. Look at me smiling there. Look how happy my guy is. No, come on. Look at how happy Triggerfish is. He's like, yay, he's using me again. He's no longer using the other skins. I get to fly all the way up here like a madman. Right? Let's go, bagel. That's what I'm talking about. All right. So, now we have a flying vehicle. And we're stuck again. This is... That's just a, a glitched and bugged area. So, let's turn those off. Let's go right. Right, 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 right. Right, right, right. We're going to keep going right, just like this. Go forward a little bit, just like that. We're going to go right a little bit. Then we're going to get out. And we're going to destroy this pillar, this one right here. This should land us safely down. Let's just check, right? Let's check. Any way to increase the land vehicles? Yeah, if you... If you just put thrusters on them, you're good. Because you can control the thrusters with the steering wheel, which is really nice. Alright, that's low enough for me. That's low enough for me. That's good. So inside this village that I have, I have these villagers here. I've talked about this before. But, I, oh, I, I changed their... I changed what they were working on. Oh, man, I'm so dumb. I'm so dumb. I changed all of their their jobs to work on like stuff around my village rather than the soil or rather than the the foiler and I just dude like guys it's not real guys it's not real it's not real I'm so serious. How can you guys seriously sit here and tell me that this is real life? That she is always here one way or another. She is always here. Every single time. Every single time that I stream, she's somewhere around me. And now I'm starving because I'm focused on her. Dude, it's insane, man. She's always around me one way or another. One way or another, she's always around. It is beyond weird, dude. It's beyond weird. Whatever, man. Get out of my face. I'm tired of seeing her. I'm tired of seeing her, dude. Let's get these guys back on textiles and we'll deal with Dana another day. If you guys have a problem with Dana, make sure that you guys just get rid of her. She is, uh, you know, probably the scariest villager in the entire game. And it's really not even close. She terrifies me. I have actual dreams about her in real life where I get scared. Um, because she frightens me a little bit. 
All right, so I put all of my villagers now back on the textiles, which means that they should now officially start getting me more silk fabric and wool fabric. But we do have to get out of here because she is an actual psychopath. Why is there silk fabric there? Oh, for my thing? Cool. All right, so it gets low enough, though. Sorry about the cough. <coughs> Sorry about that. It gets low enough, which is nice that you can just simply jump up to it. So I do actually think that this is a pretty solid. Um, I do think this is actually a pretty solid piece of equipment. Do you guys agree or no? Like, I think that this is pretty solid here. Dana is crazy. Yeah, no, she is wild. What's going on, Vince? Not card. She literally, dude, I'm not, listen, listen, let me, can I just like briefly explain the Dana thing to you guys? If you guys don't know, Dana comes to every single one of my villages, despite the fact that she quite literally does not have a house in them. Dana does not have a house in any of the, any of the villages. She doesn't have a house. But she's always here somehow. I haven't seen the new Godzilla movie. I haven't seen a lot of movies. I, I literally just sat down today for like the first time in a while to watch a movie. Oh my god, I know it really does need purple lights. It was going to have purple lights, but they destroyed them all. They ruined it on my village. Aircrafts are definitely the best way to travel, especially now with this. I just added this on to my stuff, like, you know, recently uh, to... Oh, okay. I got to change that. F and C. We're going to go forward here. We're going to go into this cave. We're just going to pretend like we're actually, like... Oh, wrong one. Again, I did the wrong thing. Driving this thing is not as easy as you guys would think. 40 power cells. Great job. I've been doing good, Austin. How are you, pal? Um, okay, I'm drifting, I'm drifting, I'm drifting, I'm drifting. Let's go ahead and let's break this. And I believe that should allow my my ship to fall enough, right? And it also has the lights under it, so I should know exactly where that's at. But let's go inside this cave. I haven't looked at it myself, but I do want to take a look at the illuminator inside of these areas and see exactly what is going on. I also do apologize early in advance about the starving situation. Let's get rid of that. And we're just the illuminator. Okay, so this... Hey, this is good. Yeah, this is fine, actually. You don't need a torch at all, yeah? What do you guys think? What do you guys think? Do we need a torch or no? Do you guys think a torch is even needed now that you have this, or what? I don't think so. Yeah, I agree. I don't think that you need one. This is actually nice. Yeah, it does. It has a great spread to it. Dang, boy. Look at this. Yo, look at this, son. Got myself some ruby. Yeah, it does look a lot better than the torch. I do like this. Ah! Burning, burning, burning. No, go the opposite way. All right. I was going to grab some bright core and then we'll head back to, uh, back to the village as well. Uh, let me know. I, I know you listen. I just looked for the first time tonight. I normally don't look at how many viewers are inside the stream because typically I don't care, but being that it's an update day, we finally broke a goal of mine, which was hitting 200 followers. So shout out to the 200 people in here. If you guys do enjoy the stream, I'm alive every single day. And I do got a question for you guys that are hanging out in here. Well, two things really. Question number one, what are you guys doing right now? Right, like, what are you guys doing right now? Are you guys watching or are you guys just playing while it's in the background? And if you guys are playing while it's in the background, what are you guys doing in the game while it's playing in the background? Are you uh, farming? Are you guys playing with the new toys? What are you doing in the game right now? Playing and watching, that's a W. What are you guys, what are you guys doing while you guys are playing? Like, are you guys... Because it is interesting to know what everybody's doing. Like, are you guys testing out some of the new builds? Are you guys building a base, playing with new stuff? What are you guys doing? Making tortillas while it's in the background. That's what I'm talking about, yo. 
Cooking with Crafty in the background. Eating spaghetti and meatballs, yo. That's what I'm talking about. Austin said he's just watching, dude. Let's go. Dude, yo. Uh, only, like, Hedgy and Austin would get this, but, yo. Dom, <laughs> Dom just texted me the most random thing, and I, I'm not laughing at this. I just don't know if it's true because I ignored, like, two of his texts. And he just randomly texted me. He said, you see that Ninja has cancer? Is this... Can anybody in the chat confirm that this is a real thing? Because that genuinely would be upsetting if true. Especially because it seems like this is something that he would have just found out. But yeah, shout out to everybody that's in here just watching. Because just watching is crazy. I thought a lot of people would be playing and watching at the same exact time. What is flying over my head? Somebody asked, yeah, so if you guys don't know, inside of the brand new update, something that we got, this is called the Illuminator. So the Illuminator is a new piece of equipment that is in the game. Oh, wow, that is so sad. Yeah, I hope it's just rumors as well. Um, oh, my creator code you're asking. Bang! Take a look at that. Take a look at the trigger fish on the screen. He'll tell you what that is, son. Um, but, oh God, yeah, Spidey snoring again. Um, but, ah oh man, I just lost my train of thought. Oh, so this is the brand new Illuminator. So if you guys didn't know, obviously in one of the most recent updates, we got the uh, compass added into the game as well as the advanced compass. Now we got the Illuminator, which instead of carrying around... Instead of, like, carrying around different things such as torches or placing down, like, different stuff, you could actually just use the Illuminator now, and that will actually do the job of it and replace it, which is really cool. You suck at LEGO Fortnite? That's not even possible. You can't suck at LEGO Fortnite. This isn't the type of game that you could suck at. It's just about playing the game and having some fun. Oh, yeah, the OP... Charms, seriously. I almost don't really like running them because they are so overpowered. And when I run them, I'm the type of person that forgets. So I have a, I have a cave exit right there. I'm also the type of person that forgets that like my guy's hungry. I've also been in this cave apparently before. This is a large cave that I've explored allegedly. I have allegedly explored this cave before. Yeah, I don't like using I don't like using the, the the torches and stuff like that. But what I will say is, I do definitely like having the illuminator instead because this seems like I could. Oh, I've been in this cave many times actually. Um, the really nice thing about this is, let's go out this exit right here. And let's see what's out here. Nice thing about this is like yeah, like you kind of free up some inventory spot. What's going on at uh, astronomy? Yo, shout out every single person in the chat that I didn't say what's up to. If you guys were somebody that responded to something that I asked or you guys were just chatting and I completely forgot to respond to you and I, I apologize, um, make sure that you guys let me know into in the chat. I also lost my vehicle. I just lost my vehicle. What's going on, Aiden? What's going on, Josh? Um... Okay, so I guess I have to go back out that other exit now, just in case. Ooh, I'm doing pretty good, Cheyenne. How are you doing today? It's been a really solid day. My video is doing extremely well today, and the stream, we hit record numbers. We also did, like, our first, like, sponsored, you know, epic partnership today. Showing off the new skin a few hours before it actually came out, which was really cool to do. And exciting. Hopefully, uh... You know, they continue to partner with me in the future. And we continue to do really fun and cool stuff just like this. And then they added the trigger fish into, uh, into here as well, which is really cool. A new villager show up? Yeah, only Link showed up. So I'm, I'm thinking that Link's is a bit common. I think that Link's is like a common... Um, yeah, I think that Link's is a common villager that is in here. I appreciate that so much, Kazzy. How's the car working above lava? No idea, but I don't even know how you would get the car in there unless you literally build it in there. 
Yeah, you would literally have to build it inside the lava. Recharge the power cells? Unfortunately, you can not. But this is something else that I built. I built this um I built this vehicle here that uh I can sit on and drive with. And now with the brand new steering wheel edition in the game, you can actually fly pretty easily now, which is really cool. So this is really nice. What's going on, Logan? Plays up bones you don't want? Ooh, yeah, I don't know, but I, I would pick up bones. Kai, if you're not picking up bones, you're kind of uh kind of doing it wrong. Pick up every single bone in the game and just throw that thing right into the compost bin. Oh yeah, the grapple is OP. On the 18th green. Wait, wait. I'm not I'm not a golf fan. I'm going to tell you that right now. We're going to go back into the snow biome with this thing. Do I need uh, power cells to steer? No. I also apologize for sitting there and like repeating what people are saying inside the chat. I know that a lot of you guys are probably reading that and that can get annoying. I apologize. Uh, it's a habit that I broke at one point in time and sometimes I catch myself doing it. So I will do my best to stop repeating something that you guys already hear in game. Thermal fish can be found inside of the desert biome and uh, a ton of other biomes, but you got to search for them late at night. Adjust the buttons. All that you need is a wrench in your inventory, and that will allow you to adjust them, which is really, really nice. What's going on, Christian? I appreciate that, Pony. Uh, I do not have a viewer world. It would almost be impossible to do a viewer world, unfortunately. It could be a lot of fun, but I'm going to stick just to mini games with all of you guys instead uh, for the time being. It should be good. Oh, yeah, the balcony in the garage. That was, that was, uh, I think it was you that told me, right? Yeah, your vehicle flew through the map. Yeah, I heard that that was happening to people and it was literally breaking their servers. But yeah, the, the, the balcony looking over is so nice and it's also like a little doorway, which is really cool. So I can kind of jump out of that as well and, uh, and do that, which is really, really nice. So I like it a lot. I appreciate that so much, Cheyenne. I appreciate everybody that's inside of here. I know I've said it a few times tonight, but uh, a little bit of a bug. I, I think I talked about it earlier. Uh, I believe that obviously the game is not perfect, but I also know that for sure that there's obviously some small bug uh, and maintenance issues that they have to address within the game. And hopefully we get those fixes in the next update. So the next update is supposed to be April 9th. Are we going to get more vehicles and prefabs? Who knows, right? Like we definitely don't know the answer of that. But what we do know is typically after a massive update like this, the next one is pretty like not so great. So I would imagine that the next update is definitely going to be focused on servers and fixes like that. So hopefully we do get some fixes for the servers in the next update. Glass, all that you need to do, you don't need to grab any resources for the glass. Although what you could do for your glass is just go ahead and scoop up some sand and that'll work. But also something you could do. Hold on, I got to get off of this. I need to, I need to get off of this. Okay, cool. I need to place another balloon. Yep, come on, let me place that. Yep. All right. Yeah, so we should just get bugs and fixes in the next update, which isn't going to be like something that people are like super, super, super happy about, but it's definitely something that's going to be needed. So bugs, fixes, issues just like that. And then uh, that should hopefully fix everything when it comes to everything in the game. Bunny skin or the trigger fish. That's up to you. I love the trigger fish skin. It's my favorite skin in the game. So you're asking somebody that's very biased towards a trigger fish skin. If a mod can go ahead and fix that for me, please, and thank you. I love the trigger fish skin. It's my favorite in the game. So if I was you, that's where I would be going. However, however, the bunny skins do look really nice. I love getting the bunny skins, especially this time of year around Easter, wearing a bunny skin and wearing some of the, uh, you know, wearing some of the skins that are decorative for the seasons is always a lot of fun. So 
I recommend doing that. I gifted one of them to somebody today. Uh, one of the bunny skins at 8 o'clock to somebody. So if you guys are going to do it, definitely do. Make sure you guys are using creator code crafty plays. So I'm just trying to find like new stuff. I've never explored this area of the map as far as like the biomes go. You guys can see like the rest of my map. I've explored pretty much everything. So this area of the map I have not explored. And now that we have the brand new steering wheel and stuff like that, we should be good to go. Mod sleep. I don't know. Hedgy, schmoo, somebody. Uh, yeah, I did go and I got 65 bright core. I really don't need much of it, but I just went ahead and grabbed some anyway. Whoa, does it really car guy? I didn't know that. Is this a... This could be an NPC down here, right? No, there's multiple, so it's not. Unfortunate. Yeah, and now you got to carry balloons with your vehicles. That's what somebody was telling me before. Ve uh, doing that with your vehicles is what makes it work a little bit better. If you carry a balloon and they, you can use it to flip your vehicle around, which is very smart. I don't know who thought of that, but that was a really good idea. Yeah, I don't even have a switch um, right now. I'm only using just the steering wheel and then different buttons as well. You don't need any switches when you're using the steering wheel because the way that it works is if you look in the bottom right corner, I have the one, two, and three area. The one, the one, two, and three that's listed on here, those are actually assigned to each thruster. So you actually don't need any, um, you don't need any switches on this. Dave Skirt with the five gifted memberships. Dave Skirt, thank you so, 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 so much, pal. I appreciate that so much. So you got, you got Jennifer Evans, you got Corey Morgan Flip, you got Ricity, and then Seb all just got gifted memberships. Shout out to all of you guys. Congratulations on those memberships. You guys can go ahead and comment on videos or just join the Discord and let me know that you guys are a channel member. That way I can give you special access into a secret room for members only. I would love to be able to find frozen fish sticks and, and some of the crazier people, but I really can never find them inside these biomes. I'm floating. I'm looking. I'm looking. I can't find them. Cheyenne, it's no big deal. Don't even worry about that. We are doing just fine. I appreciate every single one of the gifts. Dave Square has popped in here a few times and has been nothing but generous. I appreciate you so, so, so much, Dave Square. I, mean, I think you know that. I think I've said that to you a few times, but nonetheless, it doesn't hurt to say thank you a few more times, right? See how good this lowers? Well, I, Bagel, I'm more so mean like inside the, the Discord. What are you going to call the airship? I don't know. I, I don't know what I'm going to call it. It looks nice, though. I love the look of it. The white with that light blue that comes along with it. Like with the little alien lights, you know what I mean? I think it all looks extremely, extremely nice. So I don't know. Oh, geez. I forgot that these things blow up on you. I think it all looks really nice. You guys, I mean, you guys let me know. What do you guys think we should name this, uh, this vehicle in the game? If we name it anything. Oh, oh, get me out of the way. Something broke underneath of this. Yeah. It looks like something is breaking unless that was me. Nothing's breaking. That's why I love these vehicles now. Show us the wrench. Okay, yeah. So this is the wrench. I actually wanted to change this stuff anyway. So the way that the wrench works is when you go up to your thrusters, you can see that these are all labeled with number two or number three. I could change all of these into channel number two, right? So instead of three, it'll go on the channel two. And when I go on the opposite side, oh, I could see that. Yeah, lights broke. Ah, that's whatever. Not the biggest deal in the world. Not the biggest deal in the world. Unfortunate, but it is what it is. And I could trade these ones over to number three. So now that I have all of these lined up on two and three, like my turning ones, as long as my back ones are channel one. Now, when I go into the steering wheel, you see that in the one, two, and three spot in the bottom right corner, 
you guys can actually see when I press one of those buttons, R, F, or C, it will actually turn my vehicle or activate only the thruster that I uh, am planning on using. So if I press channel two, it'll or channel three or three, it'll only turn me left and then vice versa. So I could turn left, right, or continue to go center just by having those thrusters up. And I don't have to, you know, go too crazy when it comes to like breaking certain items or anything like that. So that works a heck of a lot better. Uh, yeah, Bagel. So if you're a channel member, all you have to do is comment that inside of the Discord. Let people know that you're a channel member and you get special access to a members only Discord room that's in there. I have so much sapphire, I don't need it. Here's a glitch chest that we could have gotten. Sean Kyle, smash that like button is right, brother. Thank you so much for the five beans. This community genuinely is so generous. I'm not even kidding. You guys have made it possible to create content full time on Lego Fortnite. And I could not thank you guys enough for that. So thank you guys all so, so much for all of the gifts and everything that you guys have been doing for me over the last few weeks months since i started this here's a secret room did they fix this that kind of yo this kind of ruins the vibe am i am i right or am i wrong here once again thank you so much uh sean kyle and again uh if you guys haven't make sure you guys leave a like on the stream um th so do they fix this it's not going to be like that invisible blue anymore it's going to be this dark brown wall yeah, it's definitely a little bit obvious, and it doesn't look nearly as cool anymore. I don't like that at all. I like it a lot better the old way. I'm hoping that that's not like a a permanent fix that they did. All right, Trunks. Come on, brother. Be better than this. Be better than this, Trunks. Trunks, be better than this. You're going to get that block stain. You know what I mean? Okay. So I don't even know what there is that I need inside of these areas here. I don't need sapphire. What did I even come here for? Does anybody know? It's just a room only for channel members. So it's like a channel members only room. So it's a little bit less. Um, you, you know, people obviously blow up the regular chat room. This gives you access into another more private one. So if you guys are inside of the discord, all you have to do is just say like, hey, I'm in the discord or like, hey, I'm a channel member and I don't have access. And then somebody, whether that's myself or somebody else will give you access into that part of the server. Let's hope that these things don't one shot me because they do do a decent amount of damage. Thank you so much. And I appreciate that. I appreciate all of the love tonight, guys. Most amount of viewers I've ever had in an entire stream, which is awesome. Yeah, you got, okay, guys, you guys cannot give it to me right now. You guys got to give me your discord servers inside of the discord server. I'm not going to remember your names by the time I end the stream tonight. This cave is like empty. What is this cave? This cave kind of stinks, right? Also, how does this look on stream? Not using uh, any like resources or lights or anything, right? It's nothing too crazy, yeah? Like this isn't... I mean, I know this isn't like the greatest view in the world, right? But it's not the worst. I don't need iron. What else is inside caves? You have iron and what else? Iron and sapphire. There's nothing else in these caves. Or am I, am I, like, am I going crazy? You think it's better? You think even for streams it's better too? I think it's just a little bit dark. Iron, sapphire, cursed bones. Yeah, I can't fight one of those though. I definitely could not fight one of those. Cursed bones, I guess. Yeah, so I guess there's nothing really to farm down here. But look, it looks like they changed the... Uh... Oh man, that's so lame if that's a real fix that they did. Uh, I hope I hope that that's I hope that's just a visual bug. I hope that's just a visual bug. Please, Epic, allow that just to be a visual bug. Oh, cheese! Yeah, that's true. I would just use bones. Just use regular bones if you're gonna make uh, if you're gonna do stuff like that for sure. Bones are, are probably the best thing that you can do. Face cam stream? Probably not. Uh, maybe like 10,000 subscribers will do like a, a face cam special or something like that. I do have a really nice camera that I bought, but I just don't use it in videos. 
just kind of takes away from the content. I know that obviously people want to focus on like what we're playing and what we're doing rather than looking at somebody's face. So I try my best to focus on that more than anything else. So iron and sapphire, I don't even think I need to be here. I'll be honest. Do I have my shovel here? No. Yeah, I don't even need to be here. I genuinely think I have everything. Oh, that's true. Yeah, I'm hoping that that's not what it is. I'm hoping that... I'm hoping that this is just a little bug. Because... I'm hoping... That we're just actually going to keep those blue walls. And it's not going to be like this. Where it's black walls. That's awful. Uh, I believe that that is still a thing, Sherry. I just don't exactly know... If there's like a distance to it or what because like they still do kind of come to you it's more like a magnet than anything it's not like um it's more like a magnet than anything like you don't have to go and press e on it you could just walk over it but i don't know it looks like they kind of toned it down yeah i could have sworn that earlier today it was a lot better than what it is right now maybe i'm going crazy but yeah, I'm hoping that that's, it's just a visual bug and then we get all that stuff as well. I don't really need much of this rough sapphire, but I'm here, so I might as well do it. The best charms in the game. The best charms in the game is definitely going to be the regeneration charm. So if you are if you want regeneration, which again is by far the best in the game, I believe that you're going to need um, Cursed of Bones. Cursed Bones are pretty difficult to get because the creature can... Two shot you, which is scary. It's scary to have a monster that can two shot you. But yeah, I think early, I think you're right. I think earlier it actually was working better. So maybe they toned it down a notch. I don't know. Because I also saw somebody said, "Oh, you have to you have to be the one that broke the item or whatever, and that it would you know the things would magnet to you." But I'm literally right next to these. Why are these not magnet doing? Like, why are they not just... Why are they just not coming right... Look, I'm walking right in between them. What is this? Why are they not... You have to walk right over them, I guess. I don't know. I didn't think that's how it should be, but apparently that's how it is now. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. No, I know my inventory's full, but I could have picked those up. I wasn't full in here. It looks like they disabled it or something. That's what I think happened. I think they disabled it. Unless I'm wrong. Could definitely be wrong. Oh, we got a... Uh, we got a villager. We got a friend here. We'll put one there. I'll put one there. Bang. Get me up in the air. All right. Let's go back. No, no, no. I know I have a full inventory, but I didn't have full rough sapphire. I could have picked up more rough sapphire. I just wasn't doing it. Oh, Kelly, come on. Yo, like, yo, could you imagine? Could you imagine if the reason why it didn't work as well is because of that? Oh. Wait, what is going on? Oh, sorry. I thought I, I thought I had my thing set up wrong. Oh, I know. I agree. I, I agree that it was working earlier. That, but that's that's something like they've done. Bef they've done that before, though, in this game. They've done that before. Where, uh, what was it? What was the one update that happened recently where they did that exact same thing? Where like something was working kind of fine, and then they tuned it. I forget what it was. Ark. I have not played Ark, but I do remember people. Uh, people compare this game to it a lot. I know Spidey Drew played it a lot. He's a mod uh, and a big time supporter on the stream. He played it a lot. The quick drop button. Yeah, I don't like that either. I'm trying to think of what they removed or fixed. Oh, uh, remember they hot fixed the compass when it first came out. Remember the compass? They they hot fixed that. The compass showed every single uh, you know mountain in the entire game. And then they hot fixed it to make it only things that were within 500 meters of you. How am I going to get down? I just break the balloons and that brings me down. So this aircraft works actually pretty awesome. And it's nice because I was able to build it with like the white floors with a giant H in the middle. 
the H doesn't make any sense. It kind of just gives me like borders. I, I might want to move them a little bit closer to my uh, chest. So that makes a little bit more sense. I could do like another little build inside of there. I'm not sure yet. Run through the dry valley again. Chase my 20 mobs. Beg will get it together. Yeah, this turns perfectly. Yeah, so I, I was just explaining a little bit earlier, but the way that this works now with the steering wheel, you could see me on my steering wheel and it won't show me turning, but you have access in the bottom right corner of the screen. You see like the F that I'm holding, the C that I'm holding, the R that I'm holding. All of those are controlling a different thruster on the game. So I can control different thrusters at every, you know, at all points in the game. And that'll allow me to turn, which is really, really, really cool. I'll put out a video on this, maybe. Yeah, I mean, I'll put out a video breaking down the thrusters or something tomorrow, just so people understand how they work. But because I, I originally, I didn't know that the steering wheel allowed this to work as well. But apparently the steering wheel controls everything in the game, which is absolutely awesome. So... What's that? I can't wait to see what car guy has to say. I appreciate that so much, Bagel. I tried my best. I think, I think, and I could be wrong. I think I'm the only daily Lego Fortnite YouTuber. Everybody else will take a day off or only upload like once, twice, three times a week. I upload every single day. Uh, YouTube short, YouTube post, and I stream every single day. So. I think I'm the only person doing it. And obviously, that's no shade at anybody. I don't want people to, to look at it that way. Trunks, come, buddy. Uh, that's like the sixth invite this, this guy has sent me, dude. Come on. Old activation switches earlier. Yeah, you could you could just use um, the old activation switches. That's what I was doing, Kelly. But then somebody commented that I could just use a steering wheel. I didn't know how it worked. But then somebody posted it. So... I was like, okay, that makes sense. Like, I guess I can do this. So I started just using the steering wheel instead. It's a little bit easier. The, I mean, really the only difference is now you can kind of sit back and only use one hand and control everything. Like, you know, you're just pressing like different buttons. But the other thing with it is... The other thing is... Um... You don't have to sit there and turn and point and click each activation switch, which makes things just a little bit easier. I appreciate that, Bagel. Yeah, I get all my videos done in the morning, Raven Killer. So, like, every morning I get up with my son at, like, 7, 38 a.m. I try to get my videos done before noon. And then I have my YouTube short uploaded at noon. I get my YouTube video uploaded. Hey, look, one of my old vehicles that broke right here. Look at this. Look at my old vehicle. Let's break this. Look at that. Look at that old little vehicle I had right there. What was it even doing? That was on my monorail. That's how old this is. This vehicle right here is a vehicle that broke on a monorail and now is just floating in the middle of nowhere. Poor vehicle. We'll leave it there for the memories. Yeah, because this is where my, my stuff started. My original village is all the way over here. My main uh, village is around here. I also got the um, stamina glitch again. Great job, DJ. Let me know what you think about it. I really like the bundle. That poor vehicle. Uh, no, there are brutes inside caves. They're just extremely, extremely rare. I haven't personally seen them myself, but um, I have seen other streamers and YouTubers post and they have them in there. So they definitely are in there. It's just not very common. I appreciate that so much, uh, Pot Scrapper. Scraper, sorry. Yeah, there's one of the docks that are there. Yeah, if you guys didn't know, they added different docks onto the map as well. Most of those docks kind of work in the same way as uh, some of the houses and the villages where they have those blue copper bins. So you could land at some of these houses. And now you could land at some of the... Um, now you can land at some of those other things those docks and those have it as well yeah in order to get you know to have uh to have one of them in there yeah it's definitely extremely 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 rare like i said i haven't even experienced it yet but i have seen other people do it 
Oh, that's actually crazy. That's a great tip, Christian. So what, what Christian just said inside of um, what Christian just said that you guys in uh, may or may not see is like he had one inside of his cave. So what he actually did was he killed it and then he was able to leave and he could just continue to get them to respawn over and over and over and over again, which is really cool. That's a great tip. So yeah, a lot of the, a lot of the times it does work like that when it comes to cave monsters is you guys can get them to continue to respawn over and over again. Oh, for real, Dyer, because I'd be sitting there using my dodge mechanic a million times, dude. Yeah, it would definitely be pretty difficult. Uh, yeah, the servers are still a little bit buggy when it comes to your... Um... The servers are still a little bit buggy when it comes to your vehicles. Look, there's another old base of mine. There's another old base of mine. So many little bases. Oh, actually... I got. I got to go. I got to go to one of them. I got to dismiss all of the villagers there because I don't use them. Same. I'm happy they didn't patch it either. Although now I really do think I'm just going to be using air vehicles and stuff like that. So yeah, I mean I'm also happy that um, that that's a thing, but not the biggest deal in the world to me personally. But I'm happy that they didn't. I don't know if the villagers ride with you in a sea. I'm gonna. I want to. I should test that right. I should grab one of my villagers and have them be like my little buddy, right? And then we'll see. Five Danas. Well, now here's the real test though. Seriously, this is honestly, this is the real test. If Dana is at this village, we genuinely have a real problem. This is like call the president and figure out what's going on type of problem. Let's, let's go down here and let's see. Dana, if you're down here, we're going to really have some issues. All right. So I think the rarest villager that I have here is Rustler. And I think that she is a good companion to have with you as well. But this is my old village. I'm going to ask her to go with me. Uh, let's see. Let's talk jobs. Let's explore. Yeah. Let's wrangle anything. Let's go. Shorty. Beef boss is here. I had a few really good uh, players here. Peely. I have good cooks here. But uh, let's go ahead and let's just dismiss everything. That shouldn't remove her though, right? I don't think that removes her. Okay, cool. So it does not remove her, which is very nice. And I have a bunch of stuff here that I don't use, which is really solid. So I just have her now. My base thing is all the way up here. Do I have enough to build a seat very quickly? Uh, I'm sorry if this gets a little bit stale for a second here. I need to plank in order to do it. And I also got the glitch. What's going on, Doris? Doris made it in the chat. Doris has been like a little OG. Especially as of lately. Let's drop something. Two glass. Two bone, I guess. Grab the plank. Yep, ten plank. Cool. Now let's go. Oh, no problem, Dyer. I appreciate you. All right, let's see if she will join me. And sit up here. Let's put her like this. She can watch right out the back. A little dangerous for her, but... You could always say something really corny right now. You know, like, Rustler's not afraid of danger. Like, something corny, you know? My game is super, super, super buggy right now. All right, there you go. Rustler ain't afraid of no danger. I could tell y'all that much. I tell y'all that. There she is. All right, go sit down. You know what I mean? Let, let me let me bring you to let me bring you to a brand new biome here. Spuds, what the heck is that? Tell her to get back there. The truck thing is a base. Yeah, that would be cool. The only problem, Raven Killer, is that the truck is not all that great. We tried it here earlier on in the stream. If you want to, if you want to watch the replay when we're done, or even just go all the way back and watch, but um, we did do it earlier on, and the truck broke like very, very, very quickly. It just unfortunately doesn't work that well. It seems like things are a little bit difficult, um, a little bit difficult for them to go ahead and hold, which is unfortunate. Yeah, this is my original, this is my OG area here. 
That little blue like roof down there, that little green roof that you guys see down there, that actually is um let's yeah, let's do that. Yeah. That little green village down there, that little green house is right in front of a cave that was like one of those glitched caves where it only gave you like ruby and different stuff like that and there was no monsters in it. And I thought it was the coolest thing when I first started playing this game. I was like, dude, this cave is glitched. There's nothing else in here except for like loot. And I was like, oh, if it respawns, this is the greatest cave of all time. But they don't, uh, they don't respawn, which is unfortunate. Now, something else that you guys can see that happens while I'm playing is it oftentimes obviously looks as, um, obviously and oftentimes it looks as though like I'm falling off of this thing. Something that they definitely fixed in the most recent update is it still will obviously show or even pretend like that's a thing, right? That like falling off is, uh, you know, happening, but I have yet to actually fall off of this, which you know, if you guys have been playing for a while, you guys know that that was something that happened a ton in this game. Now, it doesn't appear as though you fall off the vehicle at all. So it looks like you do, but you never actually do. Yeah, I think so. I think uh, I think it's 15 minutes of daytime, 5 minutes of nighttime. Oh, Sarah said that earlier. Cool. What's going on, Angel? Angel? Yeah, I think, I think it's, I think, I think, I think, I think it's true. I gotta start going right, huh? Building a dock? Yeah, a dock would be uh, something I'm interested in building. I was gonna build one already, but I didn't actually, um, I didn't actually begin building it. Or I did build it, but the problem was with the previous landing area and, and the way that that stuff worked was... It didn't actually do anything like it didn't actually work all that well so hopefully now that i could just break this stuff it'll land a little bit better the one and two button for the car what do you mean oh that just for for inside the car it really is nothing the steering wheel just allows you um the steering wheel just allows you to throw you know different supports or, or different thrusters onto your cars to make them go a little bit faster so if you guys want to make your cars your trucks and different things like that a little bit faster. Just add thrusters onto them. And you control them with the one, two, and three. I disagree, Walter. I don't I don't think that we I don't think we need more content right now. There's so much to do in the game still, so. Uh I do like the update. Oh, what's going on, DevRuff? I do like the update. I land this vehicle simply by just breaking both of these balloons right here in the center, and I can just put them back up. Now they allowed it to give us our stuff back, but I do like the update. I do like the aircraft, how uh, this is a little bit better. The downside to a lot of this stuff, however, is these new cars and vehicles, the durability on them is really bad. So you actually, unfortunately, can't really drive the truck or... Yeah, you can't really drive the truck or any of the cars because they just break really, really, really easily. So that's unfortunate. I would build the boat. It's just really not worth it right now. There's really nothing to do on the boats, which is why um, I won't build those. They don't refresh the caves, unfortunately. I know that that's something that a lot of people want, but um, you got to remember, guys, there are hundreds of caves all over the map. So you just got to explore a little bit more if you don't think as though um, there's stuff there. Yeah, I was going to do that same exact thing too, Grandin. Uh, I was doing blocks as well, but somebody just said, hey, put the, uh, you know, break those middle balloons and it works just as well. And I said, okay, I trust my chat. I've never had the chat give me a bad idea. No, everything does not regrow inside of the caves. That's not true. I have caves specifically that I have like waiting to reset and they don't reset. Um... You know, I'm off kid duties. I lost my leg. I was just like, what well, I was a kid. Uh, no, Dyer, I'm with you, dude. My, I, I tell people the same exact thing, man. I think Lego is like one of those things where it's just like age is no limit here. Like you could be 12 years old playing with Legos. You can be 50 years old playing with Legos. I think my, I, I don't know what my oldest age uh, viewer or subscriber is, but I know I have somebody that's 60 that plays, uh, that bought like 10 grand worth of Legos to build so lego has an extreme audience 
an extreme audience, which is awesome. I love it. I really do. Um, let's see. Let me keep catching up on chat. Is there a build for this one you're flying right now? No, there's not a prefab for it, but I can put a video out on this tomorrow and kind of talk about why I built it like this and, 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 and what I was doing with it. But... Yeah, your villagers do give glass. You just have to have them on... Um, you got to have them on the melt or the metal smelter uh, job task to do it. And yeah, I don't I don't know how your uh, vehicles are perfect. I got to tell you, my vehicles were not perfect. My truck broke extremely, extremely quick earlier. So I guess we could test if we could do a landing strip. I would put it right here in between these areas. So I'd imagine that if I broke these right, like now, it would almost be perfectly centered, right? Oh, sorry. And that's exactly why this is not going to work. What's going on, Dirt Burger? Yo, get away from that boat. Yo, get away from that. Okay. I can't break this. Oh, there we go. Okay. So now breaking that should uh, allow us to go down pretty well. Yeah, the handling wasn't great on it, but that wasn't even my biggest issue with it. My biggest issue with the vehicles being added is that the durability just kind of stinks because the durability, just for whatever reason, it they just kind of stalled out a little bit in a way. Like, you hit something and they break. Um, okay, so is this too high for me to simply jump from one of my builds? I guess, right? Build that and build that. Hmm, that might fall a little too hard. Uh! Okay. All right. Um. Okay. Um. You know that stuff like that does happen, I guess. Um. Stuff like that does happen. Um, let's... Um, oh, man, dude. Oh, man, dude. That is not good. Oh, okay. It already goes right back up to level 10. Okay, cool. All right. I was about to... Dude, I was about to, like... I was about to almost, like, cry. I thought that it was, like, done. Starts on the bottom? Yeah, I would. The only problem is that you're just going to constantly be going up, and that's how you can uh, get thrown up or down. Or, yeah, go too high up, and then it kind of breaks. That's the only reason why I don't do that. Oh, hi, it's Dom. Uh, the best villager for composting? Uh, Probably one of the newer ones. I know, like... I'm still kind of bugged, which is really, really, really annoying. I have to uh, back out and, and go back in. Lynx is really good for compost, I believe. Um, but I, again, like if I was you guys, I would not go ahead and use any of the vehicles right now. Me, I'm wearing, it kind of looks like I'm wearing like kind of like a tan shirt. And uh, a tan shirt with like um, like kind of like a... Like with pockets on the front. You know? You don't like that? Hey, okay, well, you know. If anybody in here likes likes watching Madden content, which is far as far away from uh, this as possible, make sure that you guys go and watch It's Dom. He recently did a video that featured Tim the Tap Man in it. Tim the Fat Man? Tim the Tap Man. Was he, like, actually in it? Like, was he somebody that, like you know, wanted to be in it. Probably not. I feel like he was kind of forced to be in it, but still a great guy nonetheless. But yeah, if you guys like Madden, that's my friend Dom. He's a cool guy. No, I know you move slow when it, when you're cold, but look, I'm not even cold anymore. Now look at me. I look like I'm stomping my feet. I don't want to stomp my feet. I want to just run places, you know, let me run around the map without Look at me. I'm dragging my feet. Look how slow I am. How do I have so many power cells? I was just making a bunch of them. I had so much. Uh, the thing about. I was saying this to you guys earlier. 
But the really cool thing about being inside of the shore biome that makes this a little bit worth it like and 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 fun is when you guys are inside of the shore biome you actually can get yourself some of the um bones and different things like that without actually having to do any work you also can uh oh yeah thank you i love you too dom uh the other thing that you could do is you could have your workers building on this stuff as well and i'll show you guys exactly what i have my workers on so that you guys can copy me if you guys want. I have a YouTube short going on about this tomorrow uh, that you guys can watch. But you guys can also see, like, look at my stack of wool fabric. And then look at my stack of silk fabric. This is called using your villagers, baby. I make sure I use every single one of my villagers. Maximize them as much as I can so that I get as much value out of them as I possibly can. Lennox, yeah, I haven't seen Lennox yet. There's a few villagers I haven't actually gotten to see yet. You want to see the pies too? Sheesh. What am I doing? Like, am I showing off to you guys right now? You guys want to see my entire stack of ingredients and stuff? If you guys weren't in the stream yesterday, oh, look, Tomato Head's already here. If you guys weren't in the stream yesterday, like, you missed it. It was like a farming simulator yesterday. Those are the streams that you really got to appreciate people coming. Yeah, I really kind of am abusing my villagers. I really do just allow them to come in here and work. They work. They put the work in. You're not going to be inside my village and not be working. You know? What, what do you think this is? You're going to come in here and you're not going to work for me? Come on. Show and tell. Yeah. For real. Uh, let's see. I got granite and bright core. I can put some bright core inside here. Like here. I'll show you guys. I'll show you all my stuff here. So that you guys can see. Is it helpful? Oh, the, yeah. I mean, listen, the thing is, you can't ever be too stacked. Like, that. that's like the that's like the reality. You can't ever be too stacked. Reason is, because when you have an update like this, like, what are you going to do? Uh, okay, Logan Thomas, that's an interesting thing to say. I'm going to back out and back, uh, go back in. I'll show you guys my stack. And then I'll show you guys exactly what I do in order to get all of this stuff as well. But they did, they did, and we're just going to pretend, guys, again, inside of the item shop. If you guys haven't already, make sure you guys are using Crafty Plays if you guys are buying anything inside the item shop. But today, shout out to the Epic Partner Program, I was able to show you guys off some skins early. I was able to show you guys the entire Nike uh, Airforia bundle early, which was absolutely awesome. That's, uh, yeah, very interesting there, uh... Logan, uh, I don't know if you're being serious, but if you are, that's great. And I'm happy that you're able to stop something from happening. Um, but I was able to show off the entire air for you. So shout out to Epic Games for uh, bringing me into the partner program today. But of course, the same day that I'm into the partner program, they go ahead and they literally release the, 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 the crafty bundle without actually naming it the crafty bundle. So they released the entire trigger fish bundle into the game for you guys to get. And that pretty much is like my bundle. Like if I was to release a bundle, it would be trigger fish, you know, but nonetheless, let's go back in here and let's show you guys the stack of stuff. So when it comes to stacking material, listen, the super important thing to remember when it comes to your material is any update can be super specific to one thing that maybe you don't have. So like, let's say example today, you guys loaded online and you guys thought I want to drive all of the cars or I want to build all of the cars. Well, you needed a ton of random materials in order to even do that. Like you needed bones and things like that just to go ahead and just to go ahead and build or, or use those vehicles. So if you didn't have a million bones which everybody typically just throws away then you had a, a more difficult time today than other players who kept everything so when it comes to a lot of these updates and this is why i say like people are not ready for a brand new biome and more content is more content would be nice but more content is nice if we're all ready for it like how many people really had over 500 bones sitting in a chest today. Everybody in the chat, if you had more than 500 bones, type one in the chat. If you had less, put two in the chat. And then I'll show you guys what I got. Because I don't think that a lot of people had that many bones 
But maybe you guys did. Everybody's saying one, so maybe you guys did collect. Maybe people were collecting, so maybe I'm I'm 100% wrong about that. Maybe I'm wrong about that. But if you're not in like the shore biome or the dry valley biome and things like that, then you don't have a lot of materials that, you know, a lot of us kind of get a little bit easier. But my food, I'm stacked all because my villagers. I have a pretty decent stack when it comes to like mobs and, and, and fighting people as well. All right, Bagel, that was, that's a little too many twos. Um, oh, this can all compost? Dude, let's get rid of it then. Uh, I really only play Lego Fortnite. Uh, my friend Dom is trying to get me to start playing. Um, is trying to get me to start playing. Uh, what's it called? Warzone when it drops next week or the, uh, what is it? Rebirth drops next week, but really not. I don't know. I might play it with him. He's been asking me for a while, but so I have a ton of food. So I'm never going to need food ever again. Right? I mean, this is days and days and days worth of food. I literally, I have 18 pizza pies left just from today's stream, which is four hours of gaming. Then I, I have to go out and fight more mobs and fight more creatures and stuff like that. That's probably the next thing I have to do. Because this is probably my lowest amount of stuff that I have in the game. I have a ton of poop and a ton of soil, but that's also because of the brand new stuff in the game. I have a solid amount of blast core, but I'm getting a ton every single day. I mean, all of this stuff, do I really even need to mention it? You know what I mean? Do I really even need to mention all of this stuff? Pointless. And then I also have a ton of snow, leftover charms that I really don't use and stuff like that, which is very nice to have. You know, of course it's nice to have. But then I also, like down here, again, I'm extremely, extremely organized. I have a ton of granite, obsidian, marble. I need to get more marble. I have more granite, malachite. I need more malachite, a ton of obsidian slabs, a ton of granite and marble slabs, right? But again, I need more. Ruby, I could do more of. Sapphire, I guess I could do more of, but that's a lot of sapphire that I have. I definitely need more rough amber, although I have more downstairs. Cut amber, need more cut ruby. I got a ton of sand. Look at all my iron that I have, as well as my copper, iron, copper, bright core. I mean, look at how much stuff I have collected. And even on update dates, I don't feel like I have everything that I need. You know? I know that other people do, but I don't feel like I got everything I need. Frost pine, I could do more of. Flex what I could do more of. Like, I should have every single area filled to the brim with filled to the rim or to the brim one of the two filled to the rim with everything you know like i still don't feel like i have enough because again today i had you know if you ask me to find bones for you i don't have any bones they're all inside the compost so if god forbid next week they drop something that requires bones like i'm done how do i get so much pizza pizza's easy all you have to do is just have your villagers working on just an oven and you're good to go and I agree, they do need to make it so we can we can, you know, look at our chest. But uh do you have something for me? Yeah, okay. So I had her working on this, and then look when I talk to my vi my villagers, like what I'm gonna get from all of them. Like again, I have all of my villagers working on different stuff. So I just got glass from him. It wasn't a lot because they I guess haven't been working all that much. If I did this tomorrow morning, I would get a lot more, and I will get a lot more tomorrow morning. But you just have your villagers working on so many different things. And if you do that and you have them working on, you know, the right things or the proper things, then you're good to go. I mean, look, this is a small sample size, but I was able to get fertilizer and soil, biomass and glass, a raspberry they gave me, copper bar, all of this stuff I was able to get just from one little thing inside of here. So I, I made the uh, ice cream earlier. I, I kind of am not like very impressed with the ice cream only because... You don't actually eat it. You don't actually eat the ice cream, which is weird. Like you kind of like bite into the side of it, which is just strange. But yeah, they give you a ton of stuff. And it's like, how could you, how do you pass up on all of this? Like it's, it's nice. You get a ton of stuff out of your villagers. Like, yeah. And you, uh, yeah, I'm sorry. So yeah, if you guys wanted to, let's say that you're somebody that's like, oh, I want to build, um, let's say you're somebody that's like, oh, I want to have like oven food all that you would do is not have your grill and not have any juicers on the map and you could they're only going to work on what they have available to them so they would only work on the oven 
same exact thing for like everything like down uh down at, in the basement here i have a ton of wool fabric and silk fabric i only have all of that because i only have the loom where i was getting it like i also have the silk the silk uh spinning wheel but i didn't originally have that in my village i removed it specifically so it would only work on those threads and stuff like that so you got to, you know, you got to finesse with it a little bit. You got to block things. You could put things in front of stuff. Like you could block it by putting like, you, you could sit there. You could be as simple as like putting like a wall or like something like that directly in front of it. And then they won't go and work on it, which now means that you can go ahead and actually, you know, get more out of them just because of that. So there's a bunch of different little tricks that you guys can use in order to um, really take advantage of your villagers and how they work. Because at the end of the day, like, again, like a lot of people think, oh, we need more villagers. It's not even that we need more villagers. Like, yeah, we, we, you could argue that we do, but the, the truth also is we just need to kind of take advantage of our villagers just a little bit better. Beef boss is very good at cooking. Yeah. I think he's one of the fastest. Him and tomato head are very fast cookers. But yeah, you just want to make sure that you're getting the most, you know, the best value out of your players while they're there. Yeah, I, I but I also think that they do that kind of to trick you. Like, I think they say multiple ovens because they want to trick you. I think they really only need one. I think they're just trying to trick you. Yeah, I see that the ice cream does give 10 minutes, which is actually awesome. So if you guys aren't using that, make sure that you guys are. Like that stuff is actually going to be key in this game. Um, apparently it is possible. What are you doing up there? Does she think that she's at like a concert or something, hanging out on top of a car? Get down from there. You know what I mean? I believe that you can move villagers. So she was in my dry valley biome. I deleted that biome, and now when I talk to her, I could ask her to join my village here. So you can move them. But unfortunately, I believe you can only move one person at a time. So I could probably get rid of somebody and I could keep her here instead, which is still nice. But I'm just going to have her run around with me at all times. Go. All right, Ellen, I'll catch you later, pal. Let's give her my... I don't think I can give her this, right? Take this. Give the longsword. Cool. Okay. Well, she has a longsword now. Bang, bang. Which is nice. So yeah, you can technically transfer them. It's just not the easiest of processes because like I said, you're going to lose everybody else. But the positive thing to it, yo, I lost my grapple. Where did it just go? Did I deposit it by accident? Or did I use it by accident? Did I just use my grapple by accident? There's no way, right? I'm, I'm going crazy. Okay, cool. Thank God. I was going crazy. Um... Oh, what was I just saying? Yeah, I, I would say like moving them probably isn't like the best of ideas in this game right now. But if you guys are like desperate to do it, then, you know, by all means do it. But maybe having a villager is like the smartest way to play the game. I haven't used it really at all. I've only done it by myself. So. No, that's smart, Super Tiger. Like every single village kind of has its own theme, you're saying? Or has its own purpose, as in, like, they're all working on a specific thing. I kind of do the same exact thing. Oh, I know, dude. The Lego maps are gigantic. People don't even realize how big they are. Everybody that everybody that is saying, like, oh, we need stuff to... Everybody that says, oh, we need the, the caves to respawn. We need the caves to respawn and do this, this, that, and that. Like, you really don't even need that. You don't. You really don't even need the respawn because you get all of that stuff back. You I mean, you really don't need the respawn because the map is so large. You know, there's so much that you can still travel. Like I have two snow biomes. I just got to my other snow biome to look at it. You know what I mean? Like there's so much to still loot and look at and try to, you know, try to figure out. I still haven't found any of the frosted, uh, you know, villagers or anything like that either. So hopefully I find one of them soon. Uh, let's see. Okay. Bang. Bang. Oh, yeah. Definitely built some of those. What's going on, Norbert Football? 
All right, so that was the grappler glitch. That still works if you guys did not know. Torches, I pretty much don't need anymore. So many dry valley caves, yeah. There's, there's so many like dry valley caves and stuff like that that are still in the game, but you know, again, you just gotta keep you gotta keep traveling and moving around and doing so many different things. I travel so much now. I, I moved my biome all the way out here just so I can access like a different portion of the map. So you can see I still have a dry valley biome all the way down here that I haven't explored that I still need to go and look at. I got more grasslands I haven't explored. I have some snow biome that is all the way up north that I haven't explored this entire area. So there's so much in this map that you can explore. You know, you guys might think, wow, he has so much stuff. But like I said, man, we're one or two updates away from like not having much stuff at all. So, you know, we'll see. Oh, definitely. Yeah. Uh, can I reach that? I think I can jump. Yeah. I think I could just go here and then here. Yeah. Can I really not grab this? All the way up here now? Dude, are we serious? What am I missing by a pixel to get up here? Oh, of course, Norbert. I don't I don't even I don't remember exactly who gifted you specifically, but yeah, we have an awesome community here. So if you don't hang out on the streams very often, uh this community man, they gift memberships, they hang out, they're very nice. I haven't we don't really have anybody that's very bad inside of this uh, community that I've built. Our Discord server is clean. There's not much cussing, if any, uh, which is really nice. And we also, um, you know, everybody helps each other out. So if you're somebody that doesn't have, um, if you don't have many people to play with, we have a bunch of people that, you know, get on and play with each other and everything like that. So it's very nice here. How's the garage coming? The garage looks good, I think. I don't know what else I want to do inside of here, but the garage looks fine. I think I might put like one of the truck in, like put one of the trucks in here as well. Like put one of the trucks inside of here, but uh, you know, it, it just won't fit very well. And the trucks are not that great. I had it parked out here, but you know, it is what it is. Yeah. You can play anything inside of the compost bin, um, but it doesn't always mean that it's going to like do well, you know? Uh, so the compost bin works and you guys will see it'll turn all of this bread, but it'll change it into like poop. It'll change it into uh, soil. It'll change it into a little bit of, uh, you know, the compost stuff that we need as well, but it doesn't do anything too, too crazy. So you see like 10 pieces of bread give you 10 pieces of biomass and then 10 pieces of poop. So it's like, okay, cool. But like, you know. <laughs> I wish I was getting a little bit more than that, but nonetheless, biomass is biomass, and uh, and that's good. Slurp juice for it. Let's uh, I'm gonna test that out. I got a lot of it. Slurp juice. Let's let's try it out. Kelly said slurp juice is great, so we are going to try it out. I didn't even realize. I mean, I guess I have so many different types of food that I could throw into there. I might as well just start throwing random stuff inside of here, like emptying out this entire thing, yeah? Maybe not the cheese. Put a vote square on a big vehicle? I don't know. That's actually a good question. I don't know if you're able to do that. If anybody knows the answer to that question, definitely uh, comment it down below if you could put a vote square on top of it. Vines are good for you. Okay, yeah, vines are a good one to put as well. I didn't even think about that. I'm just going to put all of the uh, all of the items in there. But yeah, so Slurp Juice worked as well, which is nice. There's a lot of stuff in there that, that works, which is really cool. So, so many different things that you guys can do in this game, which is really nice that they added all this. Because I think that the one thing that's nice when it comes to, um, oh, keep the milk. What do I need the milk for? I'm not even going to use the milk, honestly. I'm not even going to use any milk. I'm, like, I'm going to be honest. I'm just going to get rid of it. I'll, I'll get more milk eventually at some point anyway. Vine only gave you soil. Yeah, so everything gives you something different. Oh, I don't even make the shakes. I'll put my villagers on the job. You know what I mean? Yeah, the only thing is that shells are a little bit more, uh, a little bit more difficult to get. You know? Whereas the bones are definitely the best. Yeah, I agree. 
So like right now, even for myself, like I could come and I could stand like right out here and watch like I'll AFK for a second while I sip on some water. And if anything spawns around me, Rustler will kill them. And then I get free bones and free blast powder. And I really didn't do anything. We start your survival world and make a new one with the seed seven. Bego, I'm going to, I'm uh, going to do that same exact thing here very shortly, I believe. Sorry if you guys just heard me gulping. Um, will they do it offline? I believe that they do Super Tiger, but it's difficult to prove. I think that if you get offline and then you come back, they do actually uh, do stuff for you. Yeah, seed number seven is really nice because on my map, you can see that I have... Um, on my map, you can see that I have my snow biome down here. I have my dry valley up here where, with, where this gray marker is. And then where this orange marker is, I have my grasslands. So you have three of them that are really close, which is really cool. But also on seed number seven, you pretty much have this landscape here. But then like over here is the snow biome. Like where this grass is would be snow biome. So you actually have all four biomes directly next to each other. So it just makes for a much easier experience. So something that I was thinking about doing when it comes to this game is at some point in time, I'm going to run out of content to do like on one village, you know, like there's not going to be much else that I can do like on this village here specifically. At some point in time, it's going to kind of get dead. Like even right now, it's kind of a little bit dull because I did a lot of stuff off camera but um if you just go ahead and start a new world seed number seven is awesome for all of those stuff and yeah bones are definitely the best uh i threw a bunch of random stuff in there just to see like what i got out of it but i put a bunch of little things in there i also got my villagers working on the compost as well so again i mentioned a few times in stream and i'm sorry if you guys are are super 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 loyal and have been in here for a while um i went ahead and uh i have three villagers on the compost and then two villagers on the metal smelter which means i'm getting three villagers to give me the biomass and then three and then two villagers that'll give me glass and if you guys didn't know the reason why i have so much power cell is you need glass and biomass so i have some villagers getting me glass some of them getting me biomass which now means that my villagers are pretty much building me power cells on their own which is really really nice makes it a, a whole lot e easier yeah feeding sheep definitely makes that easy as well that's a good tip so and i'm not going to do a season i'm not going to do seed seven tonight but i will be doing it in the future for sure that's something i was talking about before like resetting an entire world and doing things from scratch to have a little bit more fun definitely plan on doing that um what do you guys think do you guys think that i put the what do you guys think for the garage do i put the truck in here or what because i'm not using any of these vehicles the vehicles just aren't good right now but what do you guys think do you guys think that we put the truck inside of here or should i just keep the like build another truck and put it outside instead because i have to build the truck right i can't just not have the vehicle set. What kind of YouTuber would I be if I didn't have all the vehicles set, right? Inside of here would be very big, but it could kind of take up this space right here. It would just be in the way of a lot of the stuff. I say we put it inside. Let's put it inside. Oh, I know. I'm so happy that, like, it, it's kind of funny that yeah, that's kind of what we have right now. Cruise is like a little bit of a showroom. I don't know if you uh if you've ever been a salesperson, that's why you're calling it that, or if you're just hip. But either way. Thank you so much, Nobert. Yeah, I put a lot of work on this on stream, sitting here working on this village. Let's grab all the materials needed for the truck and let's build that. So if you guys press alt on this, I know I need wood, granite, frost pine, flex wood, cord, frost pine, and glass. So let's go ahead and grab everything that I need for this. Frost pine, flex wood, glass, and cords. Yeah, any any villager can get the compost job. You just have to have enough of the compost in order to get them to work on it. 
Yeah, I'm not I'm not gonna use it. I pretty much know for a fact I'm not gonna use it. Okay, granite and frost pine rod is the last two things, and then yeah, I'll put it inside. Oh, get away from me. Little shorty, get away from me. Alright, let's see. And 63 granite, and we can build it. Yeah, so any villager can get the job, which is really nice. Um, I'm happy. Oh, what I was saying, uh, what I was just saying to Kelly was like, yeah, I'm happy that they put this update out there because it's almost funny in a way that they gave us a reason to use our. Um... All right, can you move, please? Russell, can you move? Hey, move. How long have I been playing this world? This is like my day one world. I've been playing this one for a long time. A long time I've been on this world. And I, I like it a lot. I, I mean, I hated it at first. I'll be honest with you guys. I hated this world at first. Um, because everything was super, super, super far away from each other. So it made it very difficult for me to go ahead and do certain things in the game. Especially when I started doing content. It was like, oh, I need to go and get this for a video good luck you know but now I, I relocated i took the time relocated my entire you know village moved over here and now you know things are a little bit easier for me because i can just go ahead and throw um you know this brand new village together it makes everything a heck of a lot easier yeah the vehicles are nice just they the durability on them is just not all that great and i'll show you guys exactly what i'm talking about um as well which is why i built that one skycraft as i think that that is probably more important than uh this yeah the stairs break easily but everything breaks very easily which is not very which is not so gucci of them you know is that cringe to sit there and say it's not very gucci of them regardless um but i will show you guys exactly what i'm talking about this the large front bumper this thing breaks after like half of a tree, which makes it not very fun. My favorite car, like if you're talking about in real life or in the game. Talking about in the game, I really don't have one. I'm more of an airship kind of guy right now. Definitely not interested in these builds. Definitely not interested in these builds right now. Hopefully they fix them and uh, we get better stuff added into the game here shortly, but we will see what they plan on doing all right let's see get me in this truck i also need power cells no i don't think that the update was lame i just think that it could have been a little bit better you know i think they could have bat i think they could have battle tested the update a little bit more because I, I think that if they would have made this front bumper here this blue bumper if this would have been unbreakable i understand how that sounds because like i, I understand how that sounds in a way but if they made it completely unbreakable, then the truck would actually be useful. But it's it's not unbreakable, which means it's not as useful. You know? All right. So what are we thinking? Like this? Yeah, you guys like that? Put the truck in there just to put it. I mean, it really almost doesn't fit. <laughs> it really almost doesn't fit, but it does at least hold up space in there, you know? No, I'm not doing it tonight. Yeah, it does take up too much space, but... I don't know, do we just keep it in there or what? Do we just keep it in there or what? Yeah, I didn't put down the black floors because they just... I couldn't really fit them properly. Because I didn't know where things were going to get placed. That was like the big thing. Is like I didn't know exactly where things were going to get placed when it came to the build. So I didn't. Uh, I didn't put them. Trust me. If I was able to, I would. I just didn't. You know, I didn't know exactly where all, like each car was going to go. Like even now, I'm just kind of placing these as I go. And like hoping, you know, hoping that they fit and look right. So. Oh, let's fix that. Bang and bang. And now we got our garage. And then. Oh, yeah. Extend the building. Yeah, that's true. I could just extend the building. 
Great idea. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm going to have to do. Although I do forget exactly how I built this. Um, it appears as though I did not use this piece. And I did not use this piece. Or did I? I don't know. What's my idea of mechanical mayhem? Literally what we got today. Like mechanical mayhem in the sense of like not being very positive. You know? Like I'm happy that we got this update. And I'm happy that we got new stuff. We're able to do brand new things within the game. That is very cool. And I don't want to sound like I'm complaining. I do just wish that maybe Epic put a little bit more time into the vehicles. So that they didn't like break as easily and didn't have as many issues as they do. Because like I said, the only issue right now that I have with the vehicles is that they break very easily. And within them breaking very easily, it just makes it a little bit like less fun. You know? If they didn't break as easy, th this would be a little bit more fun. But we can't always get what we want, you know? You cannot always just get whatever you want. But that that would be like my pet peeve. Like if I had like a, hey, you have one wish, what would it be? I just wish that we had like better durability on the vehicles and then we would be good. All right, DJ, I'll catch you later, pal. All right, so I think even if I just move this back a little bit and I open this area up a little bit like that, that probably looks a little bit better. I think. Yeah. Yeah, Kelly, that's the other thing is like, yeah, you genuinely need to build roads in order to use this. But this is, I think that this looks a little bit better now that I move that. So now I have this open area back here still to like walk and work. And I still have my truck and my cars inside the garage, even though I really can't use them. And yeah, they do eat up battery fast. But the good news is, and I did this when it comes to this uh, Jeep here is I have my power cell in the front, the medium power center, but then you also have on the top, I put the large one on the roof there, and you can do the same exact thing with the truck. You can put the large one down here, and you could also put another one on the top of it, and it'll drain from all of uh, those at the same exact time, which makes it a little bit nicer, because now when you're driving, it's going to... Um, now when you're driving... You're going to take from eight batteries instead of like the original four. So you just have overall more area to go ahead and go, which is really nice. And and like with the truck, you could put a bunch of them and, and it really doesn't matter. So, yeah, I'm happy with the way that this is built. Um, I'm happy with the garage. Yeah, I'm reading, Louie. Oh, I know. Yeah. Louie, you didn't know that? Louie, you had to have known that. Yeah, I think this looks really nice, especially from up top. I like this. And yeah, this is the balcony that uh, Perspacious told me to build that overlooks my garage. Now, obviously, the chests right here aren't the greatest. I'll have to design this entire upstairs area. This is like my main village, and I have not built my kitchen or food area like I should have. What's going on? Welcome back, niece. Um, sorry if I pronounced that wrong. Uh, what did you miss? Well, I forget exactly when you left. Um, but we added the truck into my garage, although we won't be using the truck anymore. We added the truck in here. We organized uh, some of our stuff. And we built our first little, like, flying, uh, our flying base-like thing. Except I can't get back up to it unless I build. <laughs> So, we will see. We'll see exactly how this works later on. No, I haven't. Uh, I haven't made one just yet, uh, James. I do plan on obviously making one soon, but I'm just not happy with how these cars work right now. So I'm not too interested in building one. Oh, let's go. Okay, perfect then. Yeah. Oh, okay. Did not want to do that. You can go right back to where you just were. Cool. So yeah, the garage looks a little bit better now. A little bit more organized, a little bit better. Uh, I have some more stuff inside here. Yeah, so your slurp juices, which doesn't even look like they're all the way done, give 20 or probably 10 each. Yeah, so 10 
fertilizer and 10 biomass. Bread does the exact same. The milk cartons and stuff mainly give your fertilizer, which stinks. And then biomass, once again, more fertilizer and the soil. So the compost, like I said, they're just very slow, which is a little bit annoying, but it is what it is. What item from the update is my favorite? Honestly, I don't even have one. Steering wheel hat, probably. Now I kind of see why everybody wanted the steering wheel, although I don't think that they expected the steering wheel to be as good as it is. Oh, so this is how you guys can get a ton of bone. This is all you got to do. Have like a villager with you and then just let them do all the work. You know what I mean? Sit there and like, hey, go ahead. You're going to fight me? Come on, Rustler. Do your thing. Bang, bang, bang. Yep, here's some free bone. You know what I mean? This is all you got to do. Sit there at your home village and let your villagers do all of the work for you. As you walk around, this is why I like the shore biome so much because now I get to walk around and it's not and, and it's not much like it's not it's not like you're sitting here getting like hundreds of of, you know, bones and hundreds of shore biome or uh blast powder, but you still do get a solid amount literally for doing nothing. Like you can you can absolutely just let Rustler or all of your villagers do everything for you. And you don't have to do a single thing. She'll do all the work for you. Just walk right out. Oh, you see a skeleton? Walk up to him. You're good to go. You don't even got to fight them. Shore biome is definitely my favorite biome. And it's honestly not even close. This biome is just so much better than every other one. I know that like Kaz and other people like this, the snow biome or the frost biome. But this one, in my opinion, is by far the best in the game. Power yourself fast. Just have your villagers work on it. Or... Throw a bunch of bones in that side of uh inside of the area as well is another really good way to do it. If you got if you have leftover bones, just throw them in there and those should do the job for you. Bones inside those compost does a very good job. So use those and you guys should be good to go. Alright, let me throw all my things back in there. I'll throw some more bones into my compost, and that'll pretty much wrap things up. Let's get those in there, get that in there. Stay organized. Of course, Regent Real July. I appreciate you stopping into the stream tonight, pal. Glass and then uh, granite. So we're going to throw that into here. Bang, bang. Granite right into there. We'll throw some glass. Bang, bang. Right into here. We have more bones that we have. We have some arrows, which I threw arrows to here. Blast powder into here, which I have a ton of. More bones. 30 bones. I get people to offer you to help you in survival world. Uh, I always get people to offer. Yeah. Um, I just don't typically accept the help. I don't mean that like in a rude way or anything, but I try, I say it all the time. Like if I, if I sit there and I let one person help me, you know, do stuff in my world, or if I just let one person into my world, then once that happens, now everybody thinks, Oh, well he let this person in. So he has to let me in and, I would rather, and, and again, like I know that people aren't going to like this, but I'd rather have nobody in my world than let somebody in my world. And now I have everybody saying, hey, you know. Oh, get people to help you. My bad, my bad, my bad. Um, sheesh. I mean, yeah, I mean, I'm listen, inside the Discord, there are people that will help you for sure. Inside my Discord, we always have people that are in there helping. So. Definitely check out the Discord. See if uh, some of those guys will help you out and uh, and do some work with you. But we will see. Just before we go, just so you guys can see, Dana is here as she always is. It wouldn't be a stream unless Dana was here. She has to be hanging out, waving, looking around. So, you know, hey, it is what it is. Yeah, I really wish that... Uh, I hope they bring those sets back out as well. I know there's a lot of people that wanted them. But... Uh, guys, that is a solid four hour stream. I appreciate every single one of you guys hanging out with me today during this four hours, hanging out, uh, experiencing these new builds, whether that was hanging out with the, um, you know, with the brand new stuff, with the brand new vehicles or going ahead and, uh, flying around with our brand new ship that we will check out again tomorrow. But tomorrow we're going to destroy this entire thing right here. Clean this up a little bit. Maybe do another extension of the garage. Then we can go ahead and place our flying build. But I hope every single one of you guys enjoyed the stream. Don't forget to leave a like before you guys head out. And I will catch you guys later. Peace.